and we are live. Good evening, everybody. Um, if you can hear us, please let me know. If you can see us, please let me know. Please let me know if everything's working fine. Welcome to another tutorial and playthrough of Anno 1800, because I played this last Saturday. The video went up this week, uh, and yeah, and I'm playing it again on Monday. So I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm liking this game, but this was a game you wanted to play as well. You mentioned that you wanted to play it. Yes. Yeah. We looked at the um, games expo, but the queue was so big, we just yes. sort of walked past it two or three times, and then we had to leave, didn't we? we didn't come mm. yeah. But yeah, you were quite keen on it, weren't you? Yeah, uh, and Emily played on Saturday and, and liked it. We all played it. So we all liked it who played on Saturday morning. Mm -hmm. um, right. So, Anno 1800. Have you played the computer game? Have you played any of the computer games? No. Right, that's fine. You don't need to have. Okay. Uh, it's loosely based on it, but it, yeah. You're trying to get points. Mm -hmm. As in most games, the points are added up at the end of the game. There is no points track or anything like that. But whenever you see this symbol here, mm -hmm. that's points. Okay. So these cards generally are worth three. These are worth eight. These are worth five. Mm -hmm. um, these cards have animals and artifacts. I'm going to say artifacts. Yeah. These are worth points as well. Yeah. Um, how else do you get points at the end of the game? It's on the cards here. Not yeah, cards here. Um, gold. Every three gold at the end of the game is a point. Mm -hmm. And if you trigger the end of the game, you get the fireworks token, which is worth seven points. Other than that, okay. it is mainly these cards. You're going to be getting most of the points from your cards. And this is the first important concept of the game. To give you a rough idea of what you're going to be doing in this game is this is your player board. Mm -hmm. These are the industries which you've got at the moment. Okay. And by placing workers onto these spaces, you can generate those resources. Mm -hmm. But you'll notice here we have loads more buildings and industries including some that mirror what you've already got and you might think well why would i want another one yeah but generally speaking these are other other ones mm -hmm. if you think about it there's like a there's a, like a resource chain so to build beer mm -hmm. you need wheat and coal do you have wheat and coal you do have wheat and coal okay so by generating wheat and coal you can build this building mm -hmm. now that you're generating beer is there anything that needs beer no i picked a really bad one <laughs> <laughs> Red. No, let's, let's take this one. This is brass, I okay. think. Yeah. It needs uh, goods, mm -hmm. just generic goods and coal. But once you've got brass, you can then start building these. Mm -hmm. Okay, so there's a, there's a definite mm -hmm. resource chain thing. Okay. None of this gets you points. Right. Brilliant. And this is one of the traps that you might fall into because you think, oh, I can do that. And now that I've built that, I can build that. Mm -hmm. And now that I've built that, I can build that. Okay. None of it gets you any points. But what you want to do is you want to build this stuff because of these cards. So these cards will have on them at the top mm -hmm. a requirement. So to play this card, mm -hmm. you need cigars, you need yeah. a fur coat, and you need a, a steam wagon, steam carriage. Mm -hmm. Well, how are you gonna get that? Well, the cigars are there. What do you need for cigars? You need tobacco and you need wood. Mm -hmm. What do you need for the fur coat? Fur coat, you need a sewing machine, cotton fabric, and some goods. What do you need for that? You need that, that, and that, right, okay. So okay. if you've got this card in hand, yeah. you already know what you need to do mm -hmm. to be able to build it, and it's actually working backwards through the resource chain. Okay. You can trade with other people as well, so don't think you have to provide all of the stuff yourself. Okay. If Emily is providing the fur coats, yeah. you can trade some fur coats from Emily as long as you're getting the other stuff. You don't even need to produce any of it yourself. Okay. Trade. You, you could trade for other people. Okay. That requires the trade tokens. But basically, these cards will get you points. Okay. The other very unusual thing about this game is you're going to start with loads of cards. Mm -hmm. You're going to get more cards as the game goes on. The end of the game is when one player has emptied their hand of cards. Okay. One of the concerns, stroke criticisms about this game when it came out is that if everybody's just going, oh, I'll carry on building stuff and I'll carry on doing this and I'll carry on doing that, yeah. it doesn't end. Mm, it can yeah. go on forever. Um, but actually, what you need to be doing is you need to be looking at bringing the game to an end mm. while all of the other players are going, oh, look at this, I can do this, I can do this. Whereas yeah. you're going, I'll play this card, I'll mm -hmm. play this card. So keep an eye on how many cards each player has got. Yeah. It's what we did last time. We kept, When we got like an hour and a half in, we were like, how many cards have you got in your hand? Mm. Five, and then they'll play two cards. How many cards you got? Three. Yeah. We, you all then know, oh, okay, this, this player is going to try and end it. Mm -hmm. um, so have a look at the cards that you've been dealt. They are only worth the points printed on them if you have played them. 
Right, okay. They're not worth anything if you don't play them. There's no negative points if you don't play them. Mm -hmm. But obviously you want to play as many as you want. Um, and you'll notice some synergies as well. Okay. You know, if you've got four cards that all require soap, yeah. you might kind of want to go down that route. Okay. There is a one of the actions you can do in the game is to cycle some of your cards. Mm -hmm. So if you've got some that really don't match, yeah. you can cycle them out and get replacements. Okay. But anyway, there's your, there's your starting hand of cards. Before we go into the objectives, and we're going to actually pick five objectives at random, mm -hmm. there are some recommended ones for your first game, but we're not going to use them. Yeah. I'll explain how the game works, and then we'll come back to them at the end, because mm -hmm. they're like optional extras. We're going to pick a start player at random, and then basically we take it in turns. Okay. That, that player gets this token mm -hmm. to denote that they are the start player. Everybody will get the same number of turns in the game. Um, so if you're the start player, Gemma will always take the last turn of the game. Yeah, okay. Yeah. When the end of the game triggers, I think you finish the round and play one more full round. Okay. Yes, you do. And on your turn, you do one of nine possible actions and then play passes to the next player. Only one of nine? One of nine. Okay. Right? And that's it. <laughs> okay. I'm actually going to explain the ninth action first. I think it's nine. One, yeah. two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, I'm going to explain the ninth action first. Okay. The ninth action is holding a festival. Oh, brilliant. You return all of your workers that you have played okay. on your buildings and anything that's to the left of your board yeah. back onto your board and that's your turn done. Okay. You want to try and avoid doing that as many times as you can because that is a it's a wasted turn. Oh, You're going to have to do it at mm. some point, but you do you don't progress at yeah. all. You're not building anything. You're not playing any cards. You're just getting all of your stuff back. Mm -hmm. So that is action number nine. Oh, the chat is not updating. Not updating. Chat is not updating on screen. Just noticed that. Thank you very much. Let me go into the template. Uh, let me go into the chat box. Let me configure the chat box. And let's go back there. Hopefully, that has fixed it. Thanks for letting me know. So that's action number nine. Right, back to action number one. Okay. Action number one is one of the main things that you're going to be doing during the game, and that is called expand. When you expand, you actually have three choices. You either build one of these buildings here, or you build one of those, which are shipyards, okay. or you use your existing shipyards to produce ships. It's one of those three things. Right. Okay? Uh, so let's talk about these. They're actually called construction tokens. If you look at your player aid, these are called construction tokens. I like to call them buildings. Okay. You produce the resources that you need at the instant you'll need it. You will notice that there are no counters in the game to represent bricks, wood, steel, whatever. Mm -hmm. That is because it uses the uh, the Kanban methodology of production, <laughs> okay, yeah. which is just-in-time production, right? Yeah. If you want to build this, you need bricks and coal. You generate the bricks and coal immediately at that moment, yeah. and then they are spent and you build the building. Okay, You don't generate them in advance, store them somewhere, and then... So you're not managing resources. You're not managing any resources whatsoever. Okay. okay. So what I would do if I needed bricks... Do I have a building that produces bricks? Yes, it has red spots, therefore I need to use an artisan. You have farmers, you have workers, you have artisans, you have engineers and investors. Okay. I think it's in engineers. So what you do is you move the red cube to there. Mm -hmm. I've now got some bricks. I need okay. coal. Coal is also red. I've now got some coal. I build that. You can build it over the top of something if you really want to, mm -hmm. but ideally you want to put it on an empty space. Are these empty spaces here? They are they are empty spaces, but only for ships. Oh, okay. Yeah. You can't build a steel mill in the sea. Okay, yeah. Okay? Cool. You can build it here. Yeah. That, that's fine. That's that action. Mm -hmm. You build one, one of these buildings, and those stay on there until you get them back. Mm -hmm. Okay. Chat is working. Yeah, chat is working. Right. Cool. The other option is that you build a harbour. Mm -hmm. The cost to build a harbour is printed on the top. Mm -hmm. Notice that the level one harbours are free. Okay. The harbours must be placed on a coastline. Okay. You can't put them inland. Yeah. Right. And the third option is that you use your existing harbours to build ships. Now, at this point, every harbour you have can build a ship. Mm -hmm. So if you had three harbours, you can build three ships. A level one harbour can only build a level one ship. A level two harbour can build either a level one ship or a level two ship. Mm -hmm. Level three harbour can build any ship. There's two types of ships. There's exploration vessels and there's... Sorry, there's trading vessels and exploration vessels. Mm -hmm. You start the game with two trading vessels and one exploration level. 
okay. uh, one exploration ship. So that is the expand action. Okay. Next, play and activate population cards. Activating is not really an action. It's really play a card. Mm -hmm. You produce the resources needed and you put the card face up in front of you. Okay. Okay. That is then your card. Mm -hmm. um, it's worth the three points at the end of the game because you've played it, but it also has a once per game ability mm -hmm. that you can use by flipping it over and then it does what it says on there. At that point, you can actually move the card like yeah. somewhere else because it, it does nothing from that point onwards. Okay. All the iconography once you've started playing is fairly clear. If you need to ask what it is, let me know. But there's some, mm -hmm. there's, there's not much. There's not much iconography there. Okay. Um, but yeah, you play one card. As I say, the action says play and activate population cards. But actually, any number of cards can be activated at any time on your turn as a free action. So that's aside from that. Mm -hmm. Swapping population cards. This is what I mentioned about cycling. Take up to three cards from your hand, put them under the respective decks, draw replacements. Okay. I don't think anybody did that. In the game on Saturday, because again, you're you're using a whole action. Mm -hmm. You're not gaining anything. There might be a time to need to use it. Right? How you get more cubes? Okay. Two, two. Well, there's one way of getting more cubes, really, which is well, there's a couple of ways, but this way is increasing the workforce. Okay. Basically, buying more cubes, and you can buy up to three. Okay. With one action, you can buy up to three cubes. The cost to buy the cube is printed at the top of the player board. Okay and then you get the cube. You take it from the supply, you put it on your board. So Sorry, so that costs all of those? That costs all of those. Right, okay. mm. right? you'll yeah. be getting them late game. So that's the increasing the workforce action. Okay. Whenever you gain a new farmer or a worker, mm -hmm. you must take a card from here. Okay. Whenever you gain a new artisan, engineer, or investor, you must take a card from here. Okay. If this is empty, you must pay a gold instead. Okay. If you can't pay the gold, you can't have the card. Okay. These run out really quickly okay. on Saturday. Okay. These didn't run out at all. Yeah. Getting new cubes gets you cards. Mm -hmm. Right. Next action, upgrading. You actually upgrade one type of cube into another cube. Okay. The cost to do that is printed between the two things. Okay. Upgrading does not get you a new card. Because you've already got the card for mm. the person. Yeah. The fact that you're upgrading them doesn't matter. And it's three upgrades, and the upgrade is immediate. So I could upgrade a green into a blue. Yeah. And then literally, again, upgrade it into a red, mm -hmm. and then again upgrade it from a red to a purple. Okay. All with one action because you do three upgrades. Okay. Okay. There's only three actions left. <laughs> Opening up the old world. Mm -hmm. Basically, you spend uh, one exploration token yeah and you take one of these and you put it here like that, I like that. gives you more space okay there's a one-off bonus on it this came with a harbor some yeah. of them have got other things on them if i want to do it again it costs two mm -hmm. i don't have to i've only got one and when you spend one from here you actually just put it there because whenever you have a festival it comes back okay but the only way to take a second one is to have two. Mm -hmm. How can you get two? You're gonna have to build another ship. Okay. Okay. Your third one will cost three. Your fourth one will cost four. Mm -hmm. Can't have more than four. Do you want to give that a shuffle in? Yeah. Right. That's opening up the old world. Mm -hmm. Exploring the new world is very very similar. It costs one, two, three, or four, and you take one of those. Mm -hmm. Can you just pass one to me? And I'll show you what it is. Now, the cost to take these is irrespective of the cost. So you can have four of those. Mm -hmm. Taking your first one of these costs you one. Okay. Okay. You take it. You have got a trading link to somewhere in the new world where you and only you can spend your trade tokens to get the resources seen on there. Mm -hmm. And that is how you build the cigar building. Our island that we're on, or our islands, do not produce, the fertility is not there for tobacco. Mm -hmm. So we've got to find somewhere in the new world that has tobacco. Okay. Once we've got it, we can use trade tokens to get tobacco, mm -hmm. which we can then use to build that. Now I say you and only you, because you can trade with other players, which I'll come on to in a minute. These, you can't have these, these are mine. Okay. Okay. I can trade for them, use them to build the buildings, which you can then trade for that, mm -hmm. but you can't trade for these resources. Okay. Okay. Also, 
whenever you take one of these, you get three of these cards. Okay. These are New World cards. They work in exactly the same way. Mm -hmm. They have a cost on them, and they do something, and they're worth five points. Okay. Okay. Right. The last action to explain is this, which is taking expedition cards. You spend two exploration tokens. Mm -hmm. You take two expedition cards. These cards do absolutely nothing. <laughs> they stay in your hand. Mm -hmm. They don't count as... I say stay in your hand. They actually don't. They go face down off to one side and you can look at them. They don't count as cards in your hand. Yeah. At the end of the game, you play them. You put cubes onto them to get the points indicated. That is what. That is how you get points from your cubes at the end of the game. Right. Otherwise, your cubes are not worth anything. Does... Does it matter what color they are? Yeah. 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 Oh, so right. this is okay. where these come in really useful because uh, okay. I would need, and you can fill yeah. either or both of the squares. I could put that on there for three points. Mm -hmm. And if I had a purple and a red, I could put that on there and I'd get that on there. And I'd, that, there's six points for me at the end of the game. Uh, How many points did you get from these cards at the end of the game? I don't know. 20 something? It might have been 28 yeah. or something. Yeah. So Emily got 28 points from these cards. Mm at the end of the game. So it, they are point generation. That's all they are. <clears throat> they do absolutely nothing during the game. Okay. Right, trading. So if you need a good, mm -hmm. either you don't produce it yourself or you do produce it, but your things are full, mm -hmm. you know, you've used them both, you can trade for other people, okay. with other people. Even if the other players' buildings are both occupied, mm -hmm. you can still trade with them. Okay. They don't lose anything. They can't reject the trade and they get something for it. It costs you a number of trade tokens mm -hmm. based on the color of the building. So if it's a if it's a building that requires a green farmer, it will cost you one trade token. If it's a building that costs you a blue worker, it's one trade token. Red is two. Mm -hmm. Purple is three. Investors, there's no buildings that use investors. So for example, if I needed some brick, I could spend two trade tokens and say, Emily, can I have some of your bricks? Okay. Emily says, yes. Mm -hmm. I spend my two trade tokens. Emily gets one gold from the bank. It's always one gold. No matter what you buy, mm -hmm. it's always one gold. And I know what you're thinking. Yeah. You're thinking here, it says three gold. Mm. That's something completely different, okay. which graphically shouldn't probably be there because <laughs> it's a completely separate thing entirely. Okay. I think that's the trading rules, except you can only trade each resource one. So if I needed two brick on my turn mm. and I can't produce any myself, I cannot do it. I can't buy one from Emily and one from Gemma. Okay. Does the other person have to consent to you nope. trading it? You just it's, say, I'm taking yeah. it. Yeah. And do they have to have actually... No, they, no they don't lose anything from it. Okay. They just get any gold. Their buildings could be used, unused, doesn't matter. Okay. And they get a gold for doing it. Right, I see. So that's trading. So what's all this gold about then? Mm -hmm. Right. Gold is useful because... As a free action, <clears throat> on your turn, you can pay the gold listed on here mm -hmm. to send that worker back from wherever they are to the residential area. Right. Thereby being able to then reuse them again. Okay. Okay? And that's what the gold cost is. So if I've used both of those and I really need to generate some potatoes, I can either trade mm -hmm. or I could spend the gold, mm -hmm. send that one back home, and then use them again there. Okay. Or if I didn't have any and I needed to generate some cotton, spend a gold, send him home, mm -hmm. put him to work there. All within the same action? Yeah. Paying gold to send somebody home is not an action. Right, okay. It is a free thing that you can do on your turn. Uh, it's called shift end. Okay. Spend gold to return a population cube to its residence. Mm -hmm. That's all the actions couple of other bits you might notice that some of these cost cubes mm -hmm. so if it costs a cube it means you have to exhaust it by moving it from a residence to there mm -hmm. okay. it cannot be already used it has to be at home yeah okay and you'll if you look you will see the cost of building all of these is that you must exhaust an investor okay which represents somebody yeah. has actually invested in your industry mm -hmm. okay any questions about because that's the end of the rules of the game. Mm -hmm. Any questions about any of the actions? I don't think so. Gemma, are you okay? I think so. Huh? Okay. <laughs> right. Cool. 
five objective cards. So these are going to change the game. Okay. There's two types of cards in here. There are cards which are end game scoring cards, and there are cards which have an effect on the game during the game. Mm -hmm. I'm going to give them a shuffle, and we're just going to pick five at random, and who knows what we're going to get. We might get a combination which causes your first game to be terrible. Brilliant. I don't know. <laughs> there you go. Somebody wants to pick some cards? Yeah. Is that so you can blame Gemma when they... Yeah. It'll be a long drive home. <laughs> <laughs> Is Gemma picking all of them? Yeah, why not? Yeah. Okay. Go on, Gemma, go there. Okay. Three, uh, four... Sorry, this right. is bad. Okay, let's have a look. Let's see what we've got. Right, so the first one is World's Fair. Okay. This is an end game scoring card. At the end of the game, the player or players with the most investors gets 10 points. Mm -hmm. The player or players with the second most gets four points. So it's an end game scoring card, doesn't do anything during the game, no. but gives us all something else to aim for. Okay. The next card is also an end game scoring card. All artifacts are worth one extra point. Okay. Remember these cards? Yeah. Everything on the left is an animal, everything on the right is an artifact. Mm -hmm. So in this game, every single artifact is worth one extra point. Willy Wibblesock. That's a new one for me. Let's have a look. At the end of the game... Light bulb. Yeah, bulb. right. At the end of the game, each industry depicted on these cards... Give, right, if you've built either the sewing machine building and or the light bulb building, mm -hmm. you get six points. You get six points if you've got that, and you get six points if you've got that. Okay. So again, it just changes the mm. changes the dynamics of what might be important in this game. The last two cards are cards which actually change the game play. Arhant, mm -hmm. on your turn as a free action, you can exhaust an investor to get five gold. Okay. And the editor, you can spend two exploration tokens to discard a card from your hand. Okay. Is that good? Well, if you're trying to win the game early, yes. Okay. Okay. So they are there. You can use each card once per turn max, right. I believe. Uh, let's just have a look at the editor. Yeah, return any one card under its appropriate population stack. Do not take a replacement to card. Right. Cool. Do we have a dice? <laughs> My kingdom for a dice. It's got to be a dice somewhere, surely. What game have I got with dice? Too many bones. There's probably a couple in Cubitas up there, isn't there? Or... Yeah. <laughs> we, need, we need the normal D6. <laughs> yes. The problem. Here we go. Right. Uh, me being one and then clockwise yeah. around the table. Three. Gemma's going first. Yes. <laughs> so you don't start with any gold. Mm -hmm. You do get this, which you can either be the male captain or the female captain. You get one gold. Yeah. Gold does go to the left of your board. Mm -hmm. I've got two. Mm -hmm. Emily's got three. And we are. Ready to start. This is a snazzy looking dice pool. It's, it's, it's a gaming rules a dice. A bit of merch there. <laughs> yeah, a bit of merch. <laughs> right. Okay. So yeah, have a look at your cards. Yeah. Work out what you want to be building. See if there's any synergies between the cards that match. Bearing in mind, Wibble. Willy, Willy Wibble Sock. Okay. and then working backwards from there. So to get that, I need that. To get that, I need that. To get that, I need that. And all of the abilities on these cards are good. Okay. So if you want to know what any of them mean, let me know. Um, What's the envelope again? The envelope is an extra action. So if you see anything with an envelope on it, it basically means have an extra turn. Right. So that combos with that, which goes with that, that goes with that one. Right, I have a short-term plan at least. Yeah. How many people watching have played this? That's a good question. Not sure how many have. 
Uh, Thomas is in the chat. Thomas said he's yet to play it, but it's on the on the shelf staring at you. <laughs> Can I buy one of these cards? Absolutely, that is the expand action. Um, Which one would you like to buy? So I'd like to buy the um, the whiskey bottle. Yeah, so you need to produce potatoes so and coal. Potatoes and coal. Yeah, and you take it and you put it on your board and that's your turn done. And you now have the ability to produce schnapps. And where can I do it again? Sorry. On any land space. You can put it over another tile if you want to, but there's there's no, unless you're planning on building five harbours. I don't think so. Yeah. Yeah, just pop it there. There you go. You're done. Um, uh, Ian is still waiting for US distribution. Yeah, this game uh, came out in Germany. Uh, came out in German yeah. about eight months ago, and it's only just come out in England, the English version. Oh right, okay. Yeah, it's been out for ages. The German version. Okay. I have a copy there. <laughs> That's the German version. All right, okay. From Christoph at Meeple's Corner. Uh, okay, I would like to expand the same, and I want to buy. This one overalls. Apron so overalls. You, yeah. So I need to put a green one. Farmer on there. there. Yeah. And then a... An artisan on there. That's a red, isn't it? Uh-huh. And then I take this one. Yeah, good. pop it there. Done. And that's it. Yeah. Huh. Uh, I am going to use the farmer to generate some pigs mm -hmm. and an artisan to generate some steel to make canned food. Done. So if I have a card in my hand and say I wanted a can... And you've and they're both gone. I'd have to trade you for it, wouldn't I? It's blue, so it yeah. would cost you one trade token, yeah. and I'd get one gold. Right, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Afloploof says played it remotely because there is a tabletop simulator mod for it. Okay. Uh, and they are working on a, an official solo mode as well. Is putting a card down an action? Yes, that is action number two, playing a card. Okay, yeah. Activating the card is not an action. That, the player aid's misleading when it comes to activating a card. It's right. not an action to activate a card. So if I had two things then and I wanted to play it, that's an action to put it down and an action to use it? It's not an action to use it. It's not, okay. Yeah. Just an action to put it down. Just an action to play it, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm going for this one. Schnapps as well? Yeah. So we have two people generating schnapps. So it is... Potatoes, Potatoes and coal. coal. Done. All right, what's Gemma going to do with the new schnapps building? Oh, that's so good. Um, is it or is it not? Mm -hmm. I'm going to play a card. <coughs> so. Okay. Um, yeah, so you just play it face up. So I need to produce those. You don't. So the blue one goes down there. Yep. And the red one goes onto there. Yep, you played it. And then... So I that, think. that yeah, that card, when you use it, when you activate it, you flip it over yep. and you take three trade tokens and you put them on the card. On the card, okay. You can then spend them, but the next time you hold a festival... If there are any on there, oh, when you spend them, they go, mm -hmm. rather than when these get spent, they go there. But the next time you hold a festival, any that are still on there get lost. Okay. So only activate the card when you when you need to. Okay. The chat has very kindly reminded us that we have to flip these. Over. Oh, that was a good point. Yes, thank you very much. Completely forgot about that. What? Oh. Because there's a few spaces on that. Yeah. Thank you, chat. Thank you, Brian. Brian. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it wouldn't be a Martin Wallace game. I missed that flipping bit. tiles. No. Uh, okay. Um, where's the soap? Okay. There. I would like to use a green pig. So some pigs. And what Get that one? gelatin out. And what was the other one? It was coal, coal. again, wasn't it? So I'd have to put red there, yeah. yeah? So I can then take that one. Yeah. Flip it. There it you go. And this is why we've got a building that generates coal, ah. but it's blue. Okay, I see. Right. So, I think I'm going to... Hmm. Yeah, I was kind of going to do this. Um... And 
I still might. Okay. Can I buy some of your soap? Okay. So you get a gold. Okay. It's a blue building, so I have to spend a trade token. Mm -hmm. uh, and I'll generate some of my own tin food to buy this guy. Now this one I am going to use straight away. So it basically gets me two workers, which means I get two new cards. That card is gone. Does nothing else for the rest of the game, so I'm just going to put it there. I've got two new cards. Okay. All making sense? I think so. It's that, you know, the end at the moment, none of us are thinking about the end of the game because we're all just building up our industry. Mm. But at a certain point in the game, which is probably about two thirds of the way through, yeah. you start thinking, right, how am I going to play as many of these cards as I can? Yeah. Take some blue coal. Okay. I'm just going to do the same thing. Yep. <laughs> so. Well, that's the blue coal building's gone. Which is a shame. Okay. Uh, I'm going to put down a card. Yep. So I'm going to put that. So I need soap. Blue and a blue. And yep. overalls. And you might as well flip it over. There's no reason not to. Take the four money. Take the four gold, yep. Right. Okay, so. Uh, beer? Nobody's producing beer yet, are they? Uh, oh, that's pretty good. Oh, except. No, that works. Uh, no, it doesn't. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Um, can I buy some old overalls off you, please? Mm -hmm, sure. So I gain one from here. It's so a blue I... building, so it costs me a trade token. Yeah. So there's the overalls. Mm -hmm. Red cube for the goods. Play this guy. Flip him over. Get a red cube. Get another card. Okay. Done. Bread, you say? Bread. If only I had some trade tokens. Is that a, a pig? That is a pig. Okay, so a pig and uh, my blue coal. Blue coal, yeah, for soap. Um. Okay, I'd like some beer then. So I want to put that one on there. I've not got any coal left, but I see Emily's got her. So I will spend a trade. We, we all have a coal building. So uh, it's, it's, a, it, which, oh, it's a red building, building, but they both, well. yeah. Emily and Gemma have a blue there? coal building, so that will cost you one trade token instead of two. Blue coal building, okay. Uh, who built first? Emily. I'll take her own because she's first. So I spend that one. You spend a trade Emily token. Gets Emily gets a gold. You have a coal. Yeah. And then I will. What did I just do? Oh, yeah. Built some beer. Sorry. That one there. Generated the wheat. Yeah. Sorry. So then so that one spins. Mm -hmm. there. I'm going to explore the old world. Let's see what we've got. Ah. I found a building that produces blue goods. Nice. It's my go done. Okay. <coughs> yeah. Is that any good for me at all? No. Yes. Play this one. So I'm going to use my bread and then your beer. Okay. And I get what? A. Where's all oh, that come from? Flash. Oh, because I put down that card. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I gave you two. You gave me two. And oh, then, wow. wow. Yeah. It's been a good day. <laughs> um, I'm going to play this one. So um, 
my soap. And yep. again, I want to use one of your beers. So do I use this token? Yep, here? slide that off to one side. side. Yep. And then I'll take my four money. Yeah, so you flip the card over, move it to one side and get the four gold. What do I use money for again? Because I'm sending workers back home. Can, I, can you um, swap this one because there's no ones? Yeah. I've got some ones here. <laughs> uh, do you want one, two, three, four? There you go, I have some oh, ones. Oh, okay. <laughs> what? How many do you need? Do you want me to swap um, with you? No, four's fine. Four's everything. Oh, okay. Sorry. Uh, sorry, what was the money for again? Remind Sending me. your workers back home. Oh, so I could send one back rather than have to do the festival thing. Or as many as you want, if you've got the gold. Ah, okay. All right. Um, and every three gold at the end of the game is worth one point. All right, okay. Um, okay, it's me then, isn't it? So I would like to put that card down to gain a red worker. So I want to use one of your cans, please. And then I need to use one of my own beer. Yeah. So you spend a trade token. I spend that trade token. I get a gold. That one goes down to here, and I then gain a red. Yeah, so you gain red, which means you gain that card as well. Okay, and then that one goes there, yeah? He goes here? Yeah. And then that card goes back into that pile there, does it? Yeah. yeah okay. <laughs> Alrighty. Um, so I kind of want to play this. But it needs bread. I don't produce bread. Oh, bread. Yeah, but I have no trade tokens. How do you earn trade tokens? Is it through explore uh, through the ships? Yeah, building a ship, and then when you do a festival, your tokens will go back on your ships. Okay. Yeah. So that's not going to work. Um. Because as we learned from the last game, you need ships. You definitely need ships. Um, but if I'm going to produce this myself, I I can. Yeah, okay. So let's produce some coal and some wheat for a bread building, which I'm going to put up here, because I can. Okay, done. Exploring the old oldie worldie. Oldie. What you found? Found a ship. So that comes immediately with a trade token. I'm trying to slide your board a bit to the left. There we go. What does this envelope mean? You can take an extra action. Oh, okay. Um, and where do you get the sails from to build this one here? You got some of them. There? Oh, okay. Or there. Right, okay. There's some blue sails. There's some blue sails. I'm going to explore the old. Well. What have you got? Um, another sail, a blue sail. Blue sail, yeah. Mm. There's an argument for doing that first because the building you get, yeah. if I'd have got that before using that, that would have been mm. yeah. more better. Okay, cool. I mean, I think I'm just going to copy everybody else. Yeah, so. if in doubt. Why not? Bricks. I think it's something everybody probably should do in the first round. You might want to explore the new world, I guess. Mm. That might be it might be a choice. Right, well I think I think I've got enough for this, which means I get to explain how this option works. Bread, which is blue. Canned food, which is blue. I'm gonna play that. So this here allows me to do three upgrades for free, mm -hmm. but I can only upgrade either a green or a blue. Okay. But it's free. So I'm going to upgrade those two into red and that one into blue. Yeah. Okay. Done. Is it cards that get you the new cubes? Or you could actually pay the resources ah, yes. to, to get new cubes that way. Okay. Which is something I was considering doing. I was considering basically producing two planks to get two new farmers. Is that an action? It is an action. It's hiring workforce. And how many can you do in one go? Up to three. Okay. Same as upgrading. Yeah. You can do up to three upgrades. <coughs> Who's producing the soup cans? Uh, tin food. Yes. It's you, Corbin. Just me. I Just me. I have yours. I have the gold, thank you. And then someone else must be producing... The overalls? Overalls is Nick. Yeah. Nick's Nick. overalls limited. I will use your overalls. Good. Thank you. I need the money. <laughs> I 
How can then you take one back so you can use it again? You can spend for red, it would cost you three gold. I think I'm going to do that. Okay, so you spend three gold. And that just goes back yep. over here. Send that artisan back to the residence. So he is there, and then yep. do I still... And that it wasn't your turn, yeah, that was a free thing. So I'm well, not free, but do this one. So I'll use my red to go back down to the steel, and I'm going to use one of Nick's overalls. Yeah. With my... That's been popular, that overall shot, oh, hasn't a, it? That was a really good shot. That was, that was the first one I bought as well. And then I'll take four. Four gold. Gold. Yeah. Nice. Cool. Okay, so I want to make some more workers then. Yeah. So uh, I can pay to take some cues back, which yep. is fine. How many, and I can make up to three in any one make turn. Make up to three. Where do they then go? Do they go to the side? Or no, they, they go onto the residence and you take cards for them. Okay, and the workers need to be free for me to do it, yeah? I... That's right, that's what you oh. said, wasn't it? Are you saying can you hire one and then use that one? No, I'm not oh, you're not saying that. I want two greens and a blue. So you need three wood mm -hmm. and a brick. You can't get three three wood. Three wood and a brick. Oh, right, okay. Increase the workforce. Um, population cubes obtained in this way can be directly used to produce resources that are required for further increasing the workforce. Yeah. So, <coughs> the question that you didn't ask, mm. the answer is yes. Right, okay. But I haven't got enough wood to do the no. amount I want to do. But somebody else, I haven't got any trade tokens either, have I? So, okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to spend two money. That's two, that's three. On two, and I'm going to grab this blue worker free here. Right. Yeah. yeah. Is that right. It depends so what then... you're doing. Because if you need two planks of wood, that has to be green. Oh, okay. So sorry then. So okay, I'm getting confused. Here. Let's just, let's do that again. Let's go a bit slow then. So one. One gold. Send a farmer home. We'll put. I can put that one. I can take that one there. Yeah. Then I can put that one onto there for one green. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you get that, you get a card. Okay. Then I want to make a blue worker also. So, so I need wood and brick, yep. say. That's the only brick, isn't it? No, yeah, it's no red. So then I could spend two money. Two money to send a blue. To send that one back. Yeah. And then put that one there. And, and that, one that one there, there, which gets you a blue. that and blue. that. And then I think that's it. I think I've run out of a phone anymore. I can't you could anymore send wood. back a green worker to then put another one out. Oh, you so can I? Green. So can I do that? Put that there. <laughs> that is a good question. Is can you do that in the middle of your turn? Uh, Let's have a look. Let's check the rules. I mean, oh, okay. <laughs> hmm. It is a good question because that's how you can generate. Three things. Shift end. During their turn, so you, yes, each you player can spend gold in order to ring in the shift end for the population cubes that have been used. The chosen population cubes is taken from its workplace. It can therefore immediately be used again. Okay. Based on that, I mm -hmm. think you can. I think you can generate one, send them home, send them back again. Yeah. If anybody knows otherwise, let me know. But so, I, so I put the one there, I think, didn't I? So I can do that. Doesn't say you can't. And then I want to do that there, and I'll take another For break. another blue cube. Yeah. Why not? Which is another card. So that's three workers. Three and workers. That's my max. Well, yeah. It? One farmer and two workers, technically. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. But yeah, most people call the cubes workers. Cool. Because my cards have been rubbish so far. <laughs> okay. Just getting that in for when you lose. Yeah. Just. Oh, you yeah. Know. You can rewind it. You <laughs> say that a couple of times. I'll probably say it again in a minute as well. Okay. <laughs> right. We are almost at the point where I want to hold a festival, but I've still got all of these workers left, and there's still. There's still other stuff to do. I could build another ship. Ships are good. Uh, harbour. I can't build. A, I can't build a harbour because I don't have an engineer. How can I get an engineer? Goods, coal, steel, and windows. We're nowhere near windows yet because nobody's nobody's got a glass building yet. So we can't have windows. Can't have windows without glass. Um, oh, hello. Oh, no, I need trade tokens for that. Schnapps. Yeah. You too? Yeah, both of us. What's this one? I mean, I do have the money. Yeah, I'm going to do that. 
I'm going to play this one. I'm going to pay two gold to send this worker home. Mm -hmm. Then send them back to work. Put that one on there. To play that, flip it over and get four gold. So one, two, three, four. Done. No, we are almost at festival time, I think. I think I'm going to get a shipping yard. That one. That one. And a brick. Oh, you got an engineer? I do. Ah. It was on one of my cards. Right. There you go. You got a level two harbour. Harbour. You got any beer? Oh, yeah, I do. What am I talking about? You're generating it. <laughs> <laughs> and how do you get more of these tokens here again? It's from. Building more of those ships. Okay. Or whenever you hold a festival, you'll get that one back. Okay. But that's just one. Nobody making sausages yet, are they? So what is, does this one cost? So that is cotton, which is from the New World. So it's from one of these towns here. Yeah, yeah it's somewhere in there. So there's cotton, tobacco, sugar cane, coffee. Okay. All of those things are not That's here. Well. Oh yes, rubber, which we mm. thought looked like a pail of milk. Yeah. Well, it does, but it's rubber. I think I want to hold a festival to take everything back. Okay, so everything comes back and your ships refresh. So. And that's your go done. Okay. Yep. And everything. Everything goes back. Everything by the side of the board, all of your cubes and all of the ones on your buildings go back. But mm -hmm. that is your turn. Um, I'd like to build an exploration boat. Yep. So you've got you're going to build ships. So yeah. you've got a level one harbor, so that can build, build one level one ship. Is that a good thing to do? Build a level one ship? It must be, mustn't it? So to build an exploration ship. No, sorry, one of these. Uh, no, a trading, trading ship. Yeah, yeah, it's just sails and wood. Okay. Uh, so I'll spend one to take him back, um, and then the guy who's done four shifts of work in one day. He's been really working really hard <laughs> compared to these lazy sods. Um, and then a blue, no, a red. Sorry, comes down to here for that mm -hmm. one. So then I take that one there, yep. which goes on to here. Yep. And then the tree. It comes token, with a token. Which goes on straight which away. Which goes on straight away. Yep. Okay, and that should be flipped. That like should that. be flipped. Cool. Right, I am going to generate some sausages. So a farmer to go and get some pigs. Uh, artisan to go and get some coal. A sausage building, which I'll put there. Done. Building my own overalls. So I need blue coal, pay one to bring back a green worker to be able to use it there. I'm going to explore the new world. The new world. Right, here we go. What you found? <laughs> yeah. I have no idea. Where does this one go? Uh, Anywhere? Sort of here. Yeah. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. So cotton, cocoa, and sugar. So you have to spend these tokens. Trade tokens to, to trade with it. Yeah. Mm. And every time you take one of those cards, it gets three of these cards. Okay. And they just work the same as they the They work the same. Now. Yeah. They have a cost and they have a benefit. Ah, so Brian is saying it is always cotton in the new world and then two other resources okay. thank you brian i didn't know that uh -huh. useful to know um beer is blue mm. do i hold a festival or do i pay to take cubes back Actually, don't forget you have one trade token if you need it. Oh yeah, okay. Um, I'm. Is anybody making sausages? Yes. 
who is you are. I am, just. Okay, so I will put that blue token there, spend a trade token to use your sausages. Oh, have a gold. Um, and then I will put that one down mm-hmm. there. And then I can take that upgrade immediately. You can use it immediately. But they have to be up here. No. No. So what happens if you use it immediately, you can actually switch ones on here, which means they would temporarily be on the wrong coloured buildings. Right. But that's fine. Okay. Um, right. I but will... you can use it on your turn. So okay. there's no there's no benefit to using it now or waiting till your next turn. All right. Can I just do it now? Then, yeah. Before I lose my train of thought. So you can upgrade three yeah. green or blue cubes to the next color. Okay. So I want one green to become blue yeah. and two blues to become red. Okay. So if you give so... me a green and a blue, I'll give you two red. There you go. Okay. And they should be where they were, yeah? Yeah. Right. right. Three gold. Send this fella home. Send him to work here. Send that one to work there to play this one, which gets me a purple cube, which gets me one of these cards, and I am done. I think it might be festival time. Does anyone make bread? <coughs> yes. yes. Who does? You two. Me and Emily. Okay. Um, yes, I'm just going to hold a festival. I'm delaying the inevitable. <laughs> There's quite a lot you can do before you throw a festival. But it's not really what I really want to do. Isn't it? Uh, okay. So it's it's things that I want to do, but not really now. Yeah, I, I eked mine out for a, a round extra. Um, I'm going to um, buy some cotton. Um, so I'm going to spend one of these to. Um, yep, yeah, spend a trade token to get some cotton from the new world. Um, it's the planks it's of wood. Planks of wood. So this is where the theme of the game comes in. There's two <laughs> buildings that generate cotton fabric. The blue one is obviously means less needs less skilled mm. workers to operate it, but to build it, you need the steam okay. engine thing. Um, I'm going to hold a festival too then. So I take these all back. You'll go, Emily. Yep. Yeah. Getting some boats. Um, and because I've got two ports, I can get two. So that one can build a level one. one that one, that one, one can build one. either a level one or a level two ship. Okay. So you could potentially build two ships this turn. Potentially build two. So I need. If I did, I'd need. Yes, I can do that. I can do two sails, two planks of wood, two sails, two planks of wood, and some goods. Okay. And that gets me one of those, and, that one. and one of those. So that's three trade tokens. How do you build? How did you build twice? Sorry. Got two harbors. I've got two harbors. Oh, okay. So if you have two harbors, you can do it one. Once. Do. Build one ship per harbor. In one action. As one action, yeah. Oh, okay. Nice. Yeah, build and discard, so. So you are generating cotton fabric. Red one. You're Blue making one. your own soap. And a. And a trade token, token. yeah. Um, so then. Issue two of these. Issue two of these. So remember, put, uh, put these to one side. They don't count as cards in your hand, but you only reveal them at the end of the game. And uh, everything on the right hand side is worth one extra point on those cards because it's animals on the left, artifacts on the right. And because of the museum, in this game, artifacts are worth one extra point. And it's the color cube. You need to put the color cube on it at the end of the game, but that color, that cube can come from anywhere. Yeah. It doesn't have to be unused. <laughs> um, does anybody have any champagne? No. No. Where is the champagne? I'm going by. There. Oh, okay. I need... Is it engineers? Is there any way to get one without using the cards? Yes. How would I do it? Sorry. You either hi- hire a new one or you upgrade. How do I hire a new one, sorry? 
you pay that cost, like you did oh, when you hired the new cubes. I see, yeah. You pay that cost. Oof, that's expensive. Isn't but it? Mm. engineers need windows. Right. The window building is not out. The window building can't come out because nobody's building glass. glass. Right. So I can't hire one at this point. No. No, engineers cannot be hired or upgraded to at this point. Okay. But you could build glass. You could build glass and then the window building and then get an engineer. Sorry, say that again. I'd have to build that one. That, to, then build. to then that one. Okay. And then once you've got that, you can then do that. Is that a little bit convoluted or is that... Well, somebody's going to have to produce glass, I think. Yeah. Because so many of the buildings require right. glass. Okay. Um, and what does that need? That needs box goods and coal. Yeah. Um, that's two reds, but yeah, okay. I'll go for it. Oh, no, that was that one there, wasn't it? Okay. So I am going to generate some bricks and some goods and exhaust an engineer. To build a level two harbour. Done. Doing some snacks and some canned goods. Was that you? No, that's Paul. That's me. Yeah. I'll have a gold. To get two blue workers. Let's get you two new cards. Oh, I see what you meant. There's cards right now, quickly. Yeah, they ran out quicker in the last game because we all started with cards that gave us two blue workers. Yeah. yeah. So at the start of the game, everybody was like, oh, wait a minute, the cards are running out. Yeah. So, I'll, I'll, <laughs> so then the cards ran out because we all thought the cards were running out. I have something on one of my cards that I don't know what it will give me. Okay. Extra action. Extra action, that is right. Basically, take another turn. For free. I think I wouldn't do that. So I want to um, activate this one so I get my three. Yeah, so you flip the card over. It's a great. You put the three tokens on it. Yeah. And then, is that my go? <coughs> nope. So then I want to build this one. Uh huh. By um, using a red for the cotton. So from cotton fabric. One of these to use um, your sausages. Please. Sausages. And, oh, where do these go? They go out, yeah. And then um, another one because it yep. takes them all. And then I get my extra go. If you want to, you can have it now or you can save the card for later. Mm, I'll save it for later. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm going to buy the glass. So you have to generate glass. One green. That would be one. It was, was red. I don't know where I put it now. Oh, no, it's not. It's blue. Sorry. So You are now blue. making windows. Right. Schnapps. It's you two? Yeah. Beer. No. Nick. Nick. Yeah. Is it worth it? Is it worth it? I think it probably is. Ooh. No, hang on a minute. That's even better. Right. Canned food, schnapps. Emily, can yeah. I have some of your schnapps? Yeah. For another purple cube. Mm -hmm. Done. Because now I've got that, I can do that, 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 and that. And over. <coughs> Lots of gold. Lots of gold. I'm going to buy um, a tile. Yep. Um, I want to buy the sausages. Sausages. So, um, I use my blue coal. Yep. Blue coal and green pig. And then I'm going to use this and have another go. Yep. So you flip it over and pop it over on your score pile. You'd have another turn. Um, I'm going to buy um, the beer. Yep. So the coal and, and wheat. wheat. There you go. You fall. So you can overwrite buildings. You can also overwrite these tiles. And if you do, you put the tile back on the board. Okay. The game cannot be broken by somebody buying it, overwriting it, overwriting it again, and causing the whole game to. Yeah. Can't happen. Okay. 
Uh, I'm going to spend three money to take a red cube back like that. Uh -huh. And then I'm going to build one of these because I desperately need one and I can't get one otherwise. So you're going to hire workforce. So it will be one box, one coal, one girder, and one window, which is four. Which is all cubes. four of those. Yeah. Yeah. Doesn't cost me anything else, does it? Nope. Okay, so that was one box, coal, coal. girder, window. Window. And I would like it. Are you just hiring one? Um, I think I'll take that one, and then I will also. I'll take a green, please. I don't think it'll be me that we end in the game with this tree. Um, and is it worthwhile? It probably is worthwhile. Doing. And then I will spend one to take that green that I've just done uh -huh. back. And then I'll go for that one. And oh, I need a brick as well, wouldn't I? You've got this if you wanted oh, it. Yes, I'll do that. Then. I'll for a blue? It. Yeah, I'll take a blue, please. One of each. Smashing, thank you. There you go. Right. Why did I want the sausages? I wanted the sausages because of oh, what? that, which got me that. Are these all the same color? They are all the same color. Didn't I not just get one of these as well? Mm. I just built one of those. That's why I put all those red ones now. Should I not? I should have a purple one as well, should I not? Did I give you a purple card? I don't know. Yeah. I did I, did I make it's too many red. of these? But I just I just I put all the You're red absolutely there. right. You did just build yeah. one of those, one of those, and one of those. Yeah. And I think I gave you two. I think I gave you a red. Yeah. Yes, you did. I shouldn't have given you a red. So you don't have the brick. <laughs> I'm just checking the chat to see if anybody spotted it. But yeah, I definitely gave you a red because there was a red on a card yeah. and I shouldn't have done blues, he's got one extra blue. Um... What? No, then you gained a green, a blue and a purple, but I gave you a green, a blue and a red. And I used that red. And you to used the, the red blue. to make the blue. So we need to take the red back. Okay. That was there. Yeah. And then you take the blue back. But you can't make the blue then. No. So yeah. that one should go back. So that one should go back. So one of yeah. your cards should go back. But then I should also get back that, that wood and brick, which I never had. Which you didn't but then I would actually want to leave that one there, so I'll take my one money back, because I wouldn't have moved it back. Does yeah. that make sense? Yeah. Okay. So I need a purple card then, do I? I gave you the card. Did you? Yeah. yeah. That was where I got confused. I gave you the card, but I gave you a red cube. Oh, right. Okay. <laughs> what the purple cards? <laughs> Are they better cards? No. The they're... they're any of those three colours gets you one of those cards. Oh, okay. So you should have three of those cards in your hand. Yes, you do. Don't there you go. <clears throat> Can you start the game with two? Right, right. we fixed it. Oh. <laughs> um, yes. Yeah, so I still can't do that. Right, so I want to do that. That's what we want to do. I need goods. I have blue goods. I need steel. Not steel. And I'm going to exhaust another engineer. Cannons. Get your cannons here. Brilliant. Done. Hmm. Have you got bread? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's sort of what I was going to do, but... Is there any point then in doing it? Buy my cannons. Lovely cannons. I feel I could use your thing and oh okay. Buy that one back. What can buy that one back? Okay. Okay. I've got to buy some people back though. So that's one and three. Four. Four. Um, so I will use my thingy. Engineer. Your cannons, which will cost you two cost trade tokens. Two trade tokens. Because they're red. Because they're red. Um. And then I want a plank of wood and a sail to get me that one. A level two military ship. 
Nice. <coughs> Comes with two of those. Ian spotted what I was uh, working towards. <laughs> well spotted, Ian. Mm. Right, Gemma. Oh, there was something I was going to do at the start of the stream, okay. and I completely forgot to mention it. So, those of you watching this live, please put in the chat whose team you are on. <laughs> it's too late now. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> so, it's hashtag Team Nick, yeah. hashtag Team Paul, hashtag Team Emily, or hashtag Team Gemma. Mm. <laughs> yeah, let us know who you're cheering for. Who's got the most cards? Yeah. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, four, seven, five, eight six, cards. Seven, eight eight ten, as well. Twelve. Ten, a few. Jim's got a few. I think it was James who started this by saying that he was on Team Gemma for a stream ages ago. Yeah, yeah. And I thought we should we should keep this as a <laughs> as a running thing. Let us know what team you're on. Yeah, there we go. Team now Nick. we're talking. Boom, number one. <laughs> Thank you. I'll show you some pictures later of uh, of his dog. Oh, okay. <laughs> Who's going? Is it Joel? Yeah, sorry, I you got the AP. Uh, just... Joel is on Team Thor and Loki. <laughs> <laughs> Sadly, they're not here. Brett's on Team Gemma. Thank you. I think I need. Um, okay, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to buy back one of my red cubes. Mm -hmm. Three, three gold. Um, and then I'm going to buy this one. So you're going to build ships. You have a level one harbour. Shit. You yep. haven't got any trade tokens though, so you can't build it. Why? Yeah. I do. I do. Oh, on there. there. It's on there, okay. So there's the sale. There, and... Um, Unfortunately, it's two trade tokens. Two? Two, because oh, it's a red building. So red buildings cost two trade tokens. Oh, what a red. Oh, okay, I can't do that then. Nope. Oh dear. Control Z. I wish that's what I was getting at as well. <laughs> when I said you can't do it. There are some blue sails, I don't know if that's worth building them. No, I've already got blue yeah, sails. Just... It's not the sails that's the problem, it's the cannon. Mm. Oh, well, right, the cannon. Oh, the cannon, yeah, yeah of, course. of course. And can I undo that yep, one? Yep, absolutely. Undo that one back. And I'll take the Three gold one. back. Yeah. So your red cube goes back from the sails? No, because um, it was already there. Oh, it was already there, was it? Yeah, right, yeah, okay. I've gotcha. brought it back. Does anyone have um, the can? So, yes, um, canned food. That can's been I really popular. I have, yeah. Mm. You've done really well. Almost as popular as your overalls. So I am going to buy back, <laughs> buy back my red for three. Okay. To go back there to my sale. Yeah. Um, to, sorry, um, the sale. Yeah. whatever. <laughs> Cotton fabric. <laughs> and yeah. then the... One trade token one for my... Token. Tin um, can food, yeah. Tin can food. And then, um, so I get a... Is that a purple It's an engineer. And I will give you a purple cube and not a red cube. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much. There you go. I was going to say, I thought it was me that was colourblind. Um, who's got bread? So, so just, just to let you know, nobody's on Team Paul. No. <laughs> but Russ has just turned up. Yeah. So, Russ, it, Russ, if you can just type in hashtag Team Paul into yeah. the chat. Thank you very much. What about Team Emily, though? There's no Team Emily. Is there no Team Emily either? I'm on Team Emily, I think. Okay. <laughs> In that case, I do have some bread. Yeah. <laughs> Gemma, have you got... Did you say you have bread as well? No, I don't have is bread. It just, is it just you, Emily, that's got some? I've got um, some. Paul has some. Paul has some. Yeah, but you're doing pretty well. My, my bread's a bit manky. See, how many cards have you put down over there so far? Um, is it quite a few? Four. Four. Mm, Paul's flying ahead. All right, I'm going to put this card down here then. So I'm going to put one... Blue worker on this beer, and I will spend a trade token to use your bread, please, Emily. He gets a gold. And then I would like another engineer, please. There you go, Russ is on Team Paul. Brilliant. There you go, thank you, Russ. Fantastic. Oh, yeah, another engineer. Yeah, thank you. And I need a card as well, don't I? Well, two engineers. I, know, I work so hard for one, and then when I, I picked up a card. It's like London buses. Yeah, I know. <laughs> that gave me them. Right. <laughs> So now that I had my plan to do that, I've realised it doesn't actually work because to build a level two military ship also requires an engineer. Mm. Wowzers. <sighs> Sales. I'll tell you what I could do. I can go crazy with the old trading tokens. Yeah, let's do it. I'm going to use both of my ships to do what Emily did. I'm going to build that and that. 
So I need two planks of wood, which is there and there. I need two sails, which is there and there. And I need a goods, which is... Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm just, it's slightly inefficient, but... Mm. Yeah, okay, done. And that comes with lots of trade tokens. Using my overalls, and I think someone is making soap. Yeah, that was me, yeah. Oh, I'm making soap as well. I will take... <laughs> I will take Nick's soap. Yes. So yeah, I, I don't think James quite understands the team thing. Oh. So he's now, got, he's now on team Vicky. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but William and Gina are on team Emily. And Chris is on team I blame Paul, which is a very common hashtag on the Slack channel. When somebody <laughs> buys a game because I did a video on it, yeah, I blame Paul is the is the hashtag. Mm, that's good. Right. Gemma, you're going to go. Gemma's going. I think. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to take um, back all my things. That's um, festival time. Yes. Yep. Yeah. Cool. You get everything back. That's your go done. Cool. Uh, I'm going to spend three to grab back a red worker, which I'm going to take off that one there. And then I'm going to put down this card here. So I need one beer, which is blue. And I need one set of boxes, which then gave me a red card. Uh, red cube, sorry, please. Thank you. And a red card. Yep. Okay. I am spending my exploration token to explore the new world. Cool. So could I have what we found? It is cotton, it is rubber, and it is sugar cane. Done. Now, do I want any of that? <clears throat> no. Uh, anybody have sausage? Yeah. I have sausage. Yeah. And anybody have canned goods? Yep. Okay, I will take the jam mm. and sausage and Paul's canned goods. Okay. Then, please. Thank you. You're making. I I'm making another person. So you get, so get just one. Just one. Okay. Mm -hmm. So the sugar cane makes rum, and the rubber is used for this, which is not in use in this game. I mean, there's no bonuses for that, and there's no bonuses for that. So whether I've got cards that need them. Yes. Ooh. Ah. Do I have to have a level two harbor before I can have a level three one? No. So why would okay? Oh, because you need an investor. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. We're not quite at the investor stage. Trying to work something out. Yeah. Um, is it my go? Yeah. Yeah. yeah I'm, I'm going to buy um whatever. Brass. Brass. I think it's brass. I think so. It is brass. So it's a coal. Coal and some goods. There you go, brass. And I'm going to put it over this one. Yep. The wild. If I'm allowed to. Yep, absolutely. Mm. <coughs> um, the harbors go here. Harbors yeah. have to go oh, on to go. On, la on the coast. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I wasn't full putting out there, really, wouldn't I? Uh, I would like to <coughs> build a level two harbor then. So I'll have to spend one to take this one here back. Yeah. So it'll cost me one of those. Um, a brick. Which I got that one for. To exhaust an engineer. Uh, he goes away. Just it. Oh, okay. And then that one goes. Yep. The... Right. Should be thinking about what I'm doing, shouldn't I? Mm. Fur coats. Sewing machines. That's what it's all about. Fur coats and sewing machines. <laughs> um, so we want that. So one, yeah, no, yeah. One gold, send that one home. 
one trade token to get some cotton from New World plus a plank of wood for this. I'm running out of space as well. Mm. Okay. Hmm, I could do that. Mm. Uh -huh. Yeah, okay, done. Done. Uh, one, two, three, four, minus to bring home one blue from there, one blue from there. But they're going back mm -hmm. because I'm playing this one. Okay. So it gets me. You're going to use it straight away? Mm. No. Okay. So you keep it face up if you're not going to use okay. it. Just because you'll lose those tokens if you do a festival. Yeah. I'm going to build this one. So, sausage. Sausage and beer. And somebody have beer. And I, have, I beer. have beer. I you have beer. beer. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say you have beer. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, do I get a red cube? Yeah, a red cube and a red card. Thank you very much. Cool. Right, I'm going to play for this card here. So, I'm going to put a blue down there. And then I'm going to use a trade token and use Gemma's beer because I've already used both of mine. So that's one for you. You got a gold. Uh, one, two, three, four for me, which I'll take instantly. Okay. So, canned food. Uh, three gold to send home this one, which I then use to generate some cotton fabric and a trade token to play this card which I could use to get an extra action, but because I hadn't thought that far ahead, I'll just say done <laughs> and use it next turn. Um, I need to trade some schnapps. Somebody? Do you have snaps yourself? Oh, you've you got run out. Yes, I do, but I need so I think to use mine. Oh, um, I, Gemma's got it. Yep, yeah, yeah. I will use yours then. And I'm also looking for soap. soap. Yes, soap as well. soap. I will take next soap. Yes. She knows I need the money. <laughs> well, one of each. I took one of each. Yeah, that's fair. Right? That's absolutely fair. <laughs> You're always, I've always said that about you, Emily. You're really fair. <laughs> one, two, and then the green into blue for three. So you must have loads of cards which they can't build the stuff for yep. yet. Yeah, is that supposed to happen? Is that okay? Yeah. You remember there is the action where you can cycle cards. Right, okay. Take up to three cards, put them on the bottom <coughs> of the appropriate stacks, and draw replacements. Okay. Now that's interesting. Is there any use for just that one on its own? Uh, yeah, exploring the new world. The new world? Mm. This one? Oh, okay. Oh, all right. know what I need to do but I need that and I need that and I need that and I need that and I can't get that because of that that's annoying yeah who's going it's Gemma's going isn't it Gemma yeah yeah sorry no that's all right I was about to say there's a lot more a lot less AP in this game than I thought there was going to be when I was reading about it but <laughs> turns are relatively Short. Yeah. You don't do much on your turn. I get the feeling you need more cubes, Gemma. <coughs> I don't know how to get cubes. How do you get cubes? So cards in your hand, or you buy them. Or you buy them. You can spend an action to hire up to three new workers. You're looking for like that symbol there. Yeah, I don't know those So either hiring them or upgrading them, because you've got lots of. Well, you've got four farmers. Mm. You could buy them at the top for these costs. Oh, okay. Or if your cards are rubbish, you could just cycle a few of them. Yeah, because more workers means you'll be festivaling less often. Yeah. Mm. Look, you could take two green workers instantly. You could take. Uh, you could take two greens and one blue, for one money this turn if you wanted to. Well, yeah, you probably. Could you? Yeah, you could. Why not? Yes, you could. 
Hang. So you would put one on there to take a green, one on there to take a green, pay one, take one of those green back, and then just put one on the brick and then back on the wood. Or you can make two blues, which are probably more necessary for you than the greens at this point, you would have thought. Mm, I think later on it's more kind of. Blue, yeah, because I'm sat here with these. Because I need more. I keep running out of reds. Yeah, I've got three green, and I think that's enough mm. for this stage in the game. Yeah. And how many can I buy in? One up to one? three. You can hire up to three new workers. And that'll get you three new so cards. Three new population cubes. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm going to go for a blue, so there and there. Mm -hmm. so that's a blue one, so you get that immediately. That's Thank you. That's one. So. Okay. And you've got that straight away, yep. Yeah. And that leaves my hand. Yep. And then I want to buy. Hmm. It's expensive to buy a red one back, isn't it? Mm -hmm. But it might be worth it in the long term, maybe. We have Kabuki Kid has joined in. Thank you for joining in. James is here as well. No, James is here early. Right. Okay. James normally pops into the stream just when we're starting the final scoring. <laughs> you're, you're here early, James. Um, I'm going to buy back. This one. Okay. So three, three Three gold. Three gold. Yep. So then I will um, do that again mm -hmm. to get another blue. Cool. Let's get another blue. So that's mm -hmm. your second mm -hmm. worker that you've hired. You don't have to hire a third if you no, don't want to. Want if you're happy to. with two. Okay. I'm happy. Cool. Um, I'm going to explore the new world. The new world. So I put mine in here. So that goes there. That's my area. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> you're going to be like that. <laughs> so I'm going to put that and I get two of these cards, is it? Uh, three. Three? Yeah. Okay. Oh, I thought these... Oh, no, these are the ones. They're I the ones you get two uh, of, yeah. Well, you get three of those, don't you? When you... Oh, it's three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I said two earlier. It's three. It's two tokens for three cards. Oh, okay. Right. Well, I am festivaling. But then I'm going to have another action. So I'll just do this first. Right, and the other action that I'm going to do is build chips. So I think if I've done this right, I'm going to build that. Mm. And I think I'm going to build that. Mm -hmm. So I need two cannons, which is that and that. I need two bits of wood, which is that and that. I need two sails, which is that and that, and I need to exhaust an engineer. Done. Nice. Right, I now have all the exploration tokens. Hashtag exaggeration. <laughs> mm. I'm making some. No, it's not what I'm doing. Yes, yes, it is. Yep. I am making some bread and I'm trading some soap. Have you got soap? Oh, yeah, yeah. Magic. Thank I you very so. much. Oh. Um, take take it gem is, Take it down with soap. So I can upgrade three things. So I'm upgrading um, one, two, and then. Blue. Yeah. I just remembered a rule that I didn't mention. Mm -hmm. You can't have the same tile twice. Oh yeah, okay, yeah, that makes sense. That would be harsh. It would. Getting the monopoly. <laughs> yeah. Of it would. I'm going to build this card. So really good way of earning money. It would be. <laughs> so I can upgrade three times. Yeah, you can upgrade three green or blue to the next level up at no cost. And I can take it from down there. And you can take them from down there if you want to. So three blue for three red is pretty good. Yes. But don't leave yourself short of blue. Mm. Unless you've got a card in your hand that will get you blue. Totally. Yeah. Um, 
upgrade three for three. Three for three. Cool. So, yeah, I was going to say you could upgrade the one in the residence if you wanted to, but if you wanted to use that one for something else, then yeah. so okay. where did these ones go? Those go exactly where they came from. Oh, okay. Now, just to note, we have one artisan in the supply. That is a fi that is a limited supply. Okay. Yeah. See, I don't know if I'm making like a strategy error here because I'm treating this a bit like Concordia where you've got cards in your hand and you're using them all because you want the money at the end of it. And I'm sort of thinking, how many turns can I squeeze before I have to waste a turn to take it all back? And I don't know if that's a good thing or if actually delaying the things that I know that I'm going to want to do in a minute is actually just... I think that's the balance in the game. Yeah. If you go super efficient and go, I'm only going to reset when I've used all of my cubes, mm. that might not be the optimal play. No. Because, for example... I've just used four of my red things to generate two cannons and two sails. Mm. If I had the space to do so, yeah. I might rest and do it again. Mm. Rather than yeah. spending another three turns doing other stuff. Yeah, that you don't necessarily want to do. But, uh, yeah. <coughs> okay. Uh, I want that red cube. <laughs> I don't have... Um, I don't have... I seem to have every card but that one. Um... Um, don't want that. Right. That's what I want to do next. Okay, I'm going to have a party around my house and take these all back. Okay, I'm going to spend two exploration tokens to venture out into more of the old world. Ah, now that comes with two free workers. Whoa. Nice. You get two cards. I right? get two cards. Because that happened on our last game, and the deck was almost empty, and I was querying whether you... It was optional, and it, it is not optional. Mm -hmm. So there you go. I just found the man and his wife sat, <laughs> sat down by the tree going, yes, yeah. Paul, we'll work for you. Yeah. They're sat down sunbathing, and you're like, you're going to go to work <laughs> oh, now. Yeah. <laughs> get here, do some work. Stop lazing about. Well, I get two cards. That's good value, isn't it? Oh. There you go. Thank you. All right. Coffee. Who can make coffee? I have a question. Um, you if could. I am going to buy back some workers, yeah. does he count as a red or a blue? I think it's red. It's got to be red, hasn't it? it? What yeah. was the question? Oh, sorry. Because <laughs> you've got mismatched coloured workers on spaces. It does mention in the rule book. Um, if you upgrade, it says, if the population cube to be upgraded is located on a construction token, i.e. building, the new population cube is also placed on this workplace. This means that the colours of the workplace and the population cube will now not match until either the next shift end or festival. So yeah, you pay to take the cube back. At the cost of the cube? At the cost of the cube, yeah. Okay, so I'll have to pay three to take back that one. I'm going to... Go on to there, and um, oh, I was going to use your bread, please, for my bread. It's blue, yeah. And I get two blue workers. <coughs> two blue workers, two blue cards. We have two cards left in this stack. Okay. Um, I would like to build some ships. Ships, you say? Ships, I say, and I want... So you have a level one shipyard and a level two. Can I build two of these? I'm calling them shipyards and harbours. No, because that's... So this one mm -hmm. can only build a level one ship, mm -hmm. and that ah. one can build a one or a two. I understand. Okay. Do I want trade tokens, or do I want... I think I'm going to build one of these and one of these. Mm -hmm. So what's that going to cost me? So it... Two sails. So two sails are two red ones here. Two wood. Two wood or two greens. A cannon. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, cool. It's red. What? Well, oh, so it cost me two, yeah. Yeah, and you exhaust an engineer. No, no, that one goes there. Done. Cool. And then they go upwards, and I get these tokens. You get the tokens immediately. immediately yeah. Right. Gino wants to know how many cards we got in hand. <laughs> Twelve. Twelve for Paul. Six for Emma. Ooh. Nine. 
12, 13, 14, 14 rubbish 14. But Emily's only got six, so we need to be careful. Is Emily going to try and rush the victory? Uh, now, I'm, no, I don't think she is, because I think she's got less cards there than I've got here. You're not going to score for that. You're not going to score for that, but you do have some of those. But those, these exploration cards or expedition cards normally require purple and turquoise workers. I don't think you're going to end it, but I might just just need to be careful. Yeah, whose goes it? Yours, isn't it? Didn't I just build these harvests? You did. Mm. <coughs> right. So I've explored. I was going to do that. I'm now not going to do that. I don't know what that means. I'll look that up in the book. Are you going to be building coffee anytime soon? Maybe? <laughs> coffee. coffee? Coffee. You've got the coffee beans. This. Oh, no, you don't have the coffee beans. You've got cocoa to build chocolate. Mm. Right, I'm going to explore the new world. I'm going to spend those two tokens. Yeah. Oh, right. That's three more cards. <laughs> uh, yeah, I have a, a lot of cards in hand. How many did you have? Uh, I can't remember. <laughs> Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I've got 15 cards in hand now. There you go. Done. That's coffee. It looks like apples. Oh, yeah. But it's coffee. Mm. New world. There we go. Three new cards. Is that what I wanted? What we wanted. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm just going to look at what that card does because I don't know. What are we in the mood? Oh. I did best of me. Okay. You've got, you've got so many cubes though, unless you want to use those ones there. Could you build a, a harbour perhaps? Yeah, you could do, couldn't you? I have got wood though, have you? I have zero money, so I can't buy anything back. Mm. And you can do that you can trade with? Because if you wanted to, have you got a red? Oh. Yeah, it looks like it might be a festival time. I think so, actually. Festival time. Let's have a party. So back. Yep. Oh. Um. got that, I got that, you've got that, and I've got that. Yes. Right. Okay. Um, sorry, I'm just I'm completely blinding out where... Ah. Okay, I will spend... One to take this one back. Mm -hmm. I'm always running out of wood in this game. Which is why that's that. Yeah, I know. I'm looking at that one for the next turn. That one there, I will spend a red one on a girder. So I will discard wood, an engineer. And a steel. And I want this one. Uh, so machine. That's not wood. What's that then? Sorry. Brass. Has anybody got any brass? Oh, someone should. I have brass. Gemma has. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, in that case, then I'll put that one back. I'll leave that one there. Sorry. Yeah, I'll take, take your gold back. Back and I'll spend a trade token. What colour building produces brass? Um, red, so it's two trade tokens. So my two trade tokens. <laughs> Do I get you get one gold. gold. But that is on the card that gets me six points at the end of the game. Isn't it, it will get you six points at the end of the game. Even though I don't really need it. Right. I'm doing exactly the same. That's, that's <laughs> hey, what I'm planning to do. So have another gold. Uh, for the brass, I generate some steel and I exhaust an engineer to build. Sewing machine building, Great which we'll put there. It does look like wood, though. That symbol. It does. Yeah. <coughs> right, Emily. So now we've got the sewing machines. Mm. Okay, I am doing a festival. I've got all these blue workers. So 
So nobody's producing coffee and nobody's got a steam carriage. Can I buy this one? Uh, if you've got brick, wood and exhaust and engineer, yes. And it will go there. It will go there. So, brick, wood and... Exhaust and engineer to build a level two shipyard. Yep. Um, what was I going to do then? I will spend these two here, uh, exploration tokens. Yep. To take one. They just go here. Goes there. No, no, no. Your what? exploration tokens go here. Oh, do they? Yeah. Oh, okay. But that goes over there. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You were pointing there. <laughs> So that lets me do coal. It's building. a blue, blue coal, coal building. Yeah, I could do the blue wood, but okay. Right. I see you there laughing at me, don't I? <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, I'm no red, uh, but I do have that. I could totally do that. Um. Hmm. <laughs> so many cards. Sausages. I make sausages. Schnapps. Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Let's play this one. So I'm going to make some sausages. Let's buy the schnapps from. I have one. We both have some. Buy some from Gemma. So you get a gold. I spend a trade token. And I flip this over and I get this red. Artisan. That's the last one. No more artisans available. So you can't upgrade there either then, can you? Nope. Let's see. <coughs> Eleven cards. Wow. Okay. Um, I'll do that. So I have access to lots of stuff, but not tobacco. All of that used. That's so bad. Is there any way to get an investor other than building? Uh, upgrading. Oh yeah. Okay. Nobody makes dresses though. Is that dresses? Fur coats. Fur coats. No, but I could, because I've got the sewing machine. Yeah. I've got the cotton fabric. Okay. Cotton. Okay. So. Oh yeah. Canned goods, please. Yeah. Just me. Oh, I need canned goods. Sewing machine. Uh, just me, and it's red. Yeah. Get the so gold. Machine. And one of those gets me this one. And I can use it to You can use it straight away to have yeah. another go. Um and the plan was um there was one. Boats. Boats. That's what I was gonna do. I was gonna buy some boats. Um that one and that one. Oh, can I? Maybe. How much? How much is a cannon's going to cost me? Two trade tokens. It's all right. I've got two left. Okay, I'll get another gold for yeah, yeah. buying one of my cannons. Cannon, a purple thing, two, two wood and two sails. Woods and two sails. Two sails. There you go. Nice. So in in your round, could you have brought two number twos? Or does it have to be a one and a two? Uh, it has to be a one and a two because I've got a yeah. one and a two. Okay. So the level one shipyard can only build a level one ship. The level two shipyard can build either a level one or a level two ship. Okay. And you can upgrade your ships as well. So later on, if you can get rid of a one, replace it with something else if you wanted to. Soap and cotton fabric for an engineer with another card. There you go. Um, a bit of a sob when you run out of trade tokens, isn't it? And all the other tokens you need as well. Yeah. yeah. Um, I know what I'm doing at the start of the next round, I think. Or do I? One, oh. two, three. No, I've still got not quite enough. Oh, I don't want to take everything back this early because I've got so many cubes. Good upgrade. Is 
pizza, you can upgrade up to three pizzas. Up to three. Yep. Yeah. <coughs> By paying the in-between cost. Oh no, windows. Windows are over there. Yeah. They are red. They are red. Mm. And I can't get any more red workers, can I? Uh no. No. Okay. All gone. We've all got lots of artisans. Yeah. We've had a slow progression to engineers. Mm-hmm. We might be upgrading them, so they might come back. Yeah. Yeah, but I kind of need all of these artisans. I need some trade and some combat tokens, but I can't get any with that. No, sorry, I'm getting stuck in a loop here of what I want and what I need to get what I want, and I don't have those things. Um, it's a waste of a turn, but I would say. You're a festival link? Yeah. Okay, so you early. get all your stuff back, Is you that get all your tokens we're back. Talking about yeah. Mm. Right, so I think I've got this. I think I send this worker to make some sewing machines. I spend three gold to send back this worker to make some cotton fabric. And then I use this worker to make some goods. Right, I now make fur coats. Ooh. FYI. Done. That's exciting. It is. Because that now opens up. Yeah, that opens up a whole extra range of possibilities now. Like investors. Mm -hmm. Because investors like fur coats. Right, so I identified that I need more trading tokens. You activating the card to get the tokens? Uh, not yet. Okay. <coughs> right. I kind of want to do. No. Keep looking at the card. Can't play it. <laughs> Can't play it. <laughs> Can't play it. Can't play it. Nope. You built that second harbor. Yeah, I'm going to build some ships, if that's okay. Yeah. And I can build two, so I was going to build a number one here, mm -hmm. and a number two here. So I need two sails. I'll just leave them up here. Yeah, just one sail, two sail. I um, have messed this up. <laughs> two bits of wood. Two bits of wood, so there's one. Yeah, so and one. then either spend a gold to send him home, or get a bit of wood from somebody else. Either or. I'm going to get a bit of wood from somebody else, okay. please. So that just Who? goes to the side. Yeah. Who are you going to take it from? Oh, um, we all We all produce wood, so oh. Emily gets a gold. Thank you. She had the least money. Okay. Um, I will spend this to use, um, is it your cannon for? That's two trade tokens. Oh, no. Can you again? Okay. So you'll have to, yeah. So um, Emily, you don't get the gold. Yeah. You so have to I'll spend, spend the, the money. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So, so two trade tokens for my cannon. Tokens. <clears throat> and my purple um, yep. engineer. There you go. That's so you get two exploration tokens and a trade token. Nice. Okay. Right. Um, I'm going to do the same that Gemma's taken. I don't want to know that I want it. So I'm going to build these. Can I build two of those? Yeah. Uh, I've got enough trade tokens. I do, just don't I? Uh, do you have enough engineers? Uh, yeah, Cannons. you do. <clears throat> Cannons. You can only buy one cannon. Ah. Mm. That was a problem I had. Earlier. Yeah. Okay, I'm just going to build the one then because yep. I want that one there. So that will cost me one red sail, uh, one bit of wood, one cannon. So that so costs two me trade tokens. Two I've taken red. my gold. Okay. Oh, yeah. Why do you <clears> keep doing that? It's such a fool. <laughs> um, and then one engineer. And yeah. That and then I get those two immediately, don't yeah. I? Yeah. Okay. Right. Spend three money. Send him home. Then give him a ring and say, get back to work. Make some more. Mm -hmm. um, Gemma, schnapps? Yes, please. And a trade token for an extra action. <coughs> and five points. Um, 
and the extra action, I think. is going to be to play that, so I'll spend another three money to send this person home again and then get him back to work again for that and some bread for this, which is three points and an engineer. It's great value for money, isn't it? That card, in terms of what you got for what you spent, a bit of bread and a bit of toilet paper. Yeah, but that requires <laughs> new, new world fancy yeah. stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Done. Yeah, it's like a pandemic, isn't it? People are panic buying. There's a lot of value on toilet paper in this part of the world. <laughs> <laughs> right, I think I've got about five moves. <clears throat> glass. Who has glass? It's Me. Uh, Nick has glass and windows. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of commodities over here. Um. I will use your glass, please. Um, um glasses. Where's my glass? Let's put it. Okay. One to send it back mm -hmm. and pull it back to build my own windows. Okay. I do have windows as well, by the way, you could use next time. That's cheeky, isn't it? She's using your glass to make her own window. Selfish, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Um, I was going to explore the old world again, so there's my two. It's going to cost you two for your second one. Yeah. Two um, things. See what you found. Well, I'll have. There's no red people. What happens? There's no red people. Oh no. Do I get? I a, just don't think you get do it. Do I get a blue one? No. <laughs> no, afraid not. Compensation. I don't think you get it. That's really unfair. It is. I feel like the game doesn't doesn't like them. <laughs> was it you can only you trade one item per your? Thing. If this is not possible, the effect cannot be used or not used to the full extent. So yeah, yeah. Oh, can't get it. I thought you could at least get a blue worker's yeah. compensation. <laughs> Sorry, you can't use trade tokens to trade more than one type of good per turn. Is that right? No. No. Okay. You cannot trade more than one of each type of token. But I could say if I had something that needed three things that I didn't have, I could take one. Absolutely. Three times. Yeah. Okay. All right. Cool. Um, you I'm just couldn't have bought two cannons from me, or two, or one cannon from two different people. I understand. Okay, uh, I'm going to do that one. I'm going to spend these two tokens here. Yeah. To do that. And are you I flipping it? Three. Yes, I do. You are. Okay. Oh yeah, because you got plenty of things left. So they go on here. Don't they, they go on there. You'll lose them if you and do a festival. And then they go to that side. Yes. Okay. I am going to do a festival. That's my go done. Second turn. Oh, that's the stream. Right. So now that I'm making fur coats. Or I could. Oh, yeah, but then if you do that, then you don't get new workers, you just upgrade your old ones. Light bulbs. Need investor, has it? Nobody's got an investor yet, have they? No. But it's. I feel it's imminent. Soon. <coughs> to upgrade this one, then you have to spend a red. Yeah. So they would go back. No, it's just exhaust. Ah, uh, sorry, John. <laughs> what What do I have here? I've got cotton and. Still don't have that. Do that. Maybe yeah, I can't do that because I don't have any wood. Um, yeah, I've got about five mm. cards in my hand that I just cannot play. Mm. But a lot of these are waiting for investors to come out. Yeah. Mm. As soon as they do, I think it'll. Escalate upwards. I think I'm 
think I'm just going to buy a, what are they called again? Engineer? Engineer. Just one? Yeah, it's all I can afford. You get an engineer and you get a card. Right, Gemma. Um, Sean says, who's winning? It's a good question. I don't know. I don't know. I can tell you how many points I've got from cards, but other than that, me and you have both got six points for the sewing machine because of yeah, because Willy of Wibble Sock. I am going to buy the barrel. Um, ah, rum. So I You're going to make some rum. One of my things to do that. Trade for some sugar cane with the new world. And then the other one was wood. Um, wood. So I spend one. Yeah. To to... Oh, right. Thank you. So rum is now available as a resource. Fantastic. Okay, I want to. Um, what about cans? No, that's you calling that. Uh, I am still the only producer of canned food. Okay, I would like to. Who's got cotton and bread? Who's got bread? Me. Me. Who's got cotton? Me and Gemma. Who had you had bread, didn't you? Paul? Yes. I got Emily's got bread as well. Okay, I'm going to use this card here, and which will cost me one bread, <laughs> one cotton, and one trade token. So I'll use one of your ones each, and I'll use these three. So it's two trade tokens for the cotton. Okay. Yeah. It's four so one of them goes there. Three of them go over there. Cool. One trade token for Emily's bread. Yeah. Bread. Yep. And then that one for there. And yes, then I get that. two of these. You get two of the expedition cards. Yeah. Only um, points at the end of the game. Yes. Yeah? If you put the appropriate colour cubes on them. Five points as well. My go. Oh, we had a plan. What was the plan? <laughs> I've forgotten now. It gets you the number of points that are below it, doesn't it? Yes. Plus one if it's an artifact. Oh, yeah. Okay. All the artifacts are on the right. Fantastic. Oh, my God. What was the plan? <laughs> Literally about to do something. That was it. Yes, I am. I am upgrading. So I'm going to generate two fur coats, and I'm going to exhaust two artisans to turn two purple cubes into two investors. So that's two upgrades, and I am also going to generate some uh, coal. Uh, Gemma, you produce blue coal. Uh, yes, I do. Yeah. I do as well. I'll go for Jenna. Yeah. Well, I got blue coal. All three of you have got blue coal. Yeah. Oh. So you get a gold for the coal. I thought there were only two. Oh, my he got a, on he's got a special one. <sighs> uh, to move that blue. Oh, and I can't. <laughs> no, forget that. <laughs> I can't, so yeah, I can't, I, can't, I can't turn a blue into a red. Because <laughs> there's no red. <laughs> <laughs> ah. In which case, I'll spend. Everybody got? Is there such a thing as blue bricks? There is. It's there. Hmm. This is tricky, isn't it? Okay, so right, I'm going to undo that. Um, I'm only going to do one. Right, so there's one upgrade. You take a card. Uh, you don't take cards if you upgrade. Oh yeah. Probably. My second upgrade is going to be blue coal. So you do get a gold. Oh, thank you. And the box to upgrade this blue into red. But hang on a minute. Before I do that, windows. Mm -hmm. What color are your windows? Blue. So no windows. Sorry, red. Uh, windows are red. Yeah. yeah. So you get a gold. I spend two trade tokens, and I put that on there. Mm -hmm. So I'm basically going to upgrade a red into a purple, and then the blue goes into a red. 
Right, there you go. That's my three upgrades done. Uh -huh. Right, yay! We have we have an investor. An investor can do all sorts of stuff now. Cool. Did you say yep. that um, people can't use each other's? Correct. Under those. Yeah. So the only way to get um, those is to take another one of those. Is to take. It's a bit of a. It's game. not the only way. There is another way. I've got a card that says um, use this card to get. Oh right. A resource as a one-off thing because it would really help me if somebody who could build the coffee okay <laughs> I'm, I'll, I'll consider it because it'd actually help me as well yeah um, okay I will make coffee though it sounds like there we go there is a demand there is a demand so you need coffee beans and coal yeah mix it together Nescafe <laughs> <laughs> secret ingredient right coffee is now available come and buy your coffee suddenly <laughs> no no these cards still don't work mm -hmm. I'm going to swap three cards. Oh, right. Now they don't have to be the same decks. So two and of those they are not. and one of those. So that one goes to the bottom and you get that one. Thank you. And then those two, two go to those. the bottom and you get those two. Thank you. Okay, here we go. Okay. Um, I'm going to spend these two tokens here, which go uh -huh. to that side this time. And I will take three of these trade tokens, which I will take immediately. Right, so glass, oh no. glass is not here. Uh, yeah, glass it is, is. It is blue. Glass not windows is blue. Yeah. yeah. So I will trade for some glass. Thank you kindly. Um, and I'm going to generate some coal. And um, fight, Emily. Blue yeah. coal. Blue coal. Blue coal. So there's the coal. There's the glass. And I will exhaust this investor to build some light bulbs. Ooh, good move. Six points. And it's a purple building, so it's three trade tokens if you want to buy any light bulbs. And yes, six points at the end of the game because of Willy Wibblesock. <laughs> I like that name. <laughs> People used to be called cool. silly names like that. <laughs> Nobody's built champagne yet there, have they? I could do with some champagne for two reasons. <laughs> and only one relates to the board game. <laughs> Costs two. Right. That. Costs two. That. No, one more I don't want any beer. Person. One more. Just one more. Got any trade tokens? Nope. Ooh. More out. Got five, spent them all. Probably um, shouldn't have spent that trade token. Yeah, mm. my fault. Cool has that, so I don't need to make that, but I do need to make that one. Ah, but. I can't make that one yet. <coughs> or Ta -da. Um, that one, but again, I can't make that one. Right, so I'm going to explore the new world again. Okay. Because I don't have what I need. Did you found this time? Sorry. Nope. Sabotage. My phone's back to full moment. Oh, that's better. What have you got? I've got to take more of these, haven't I? Uh, three of them. What did I take? That's unfortunate. Yes, I did. Oh, interesting. I really regret copying this from Ava now. <laughs> what did you overwrite? Mm. The red sails. sails. Yeah. Red sails. You could get some blue sails if you wanted. Yeah, you trade or send or people home. Or you could use somebody else's, but it'll cost you two trade tokens. Um, Only one for the blue sails, though. I think has somebody else got blue sails? Nobody else has got them. Oh, yeah. no, nobody yeah. has. You all done? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Who 
Nobody's gone for the big guns oh, yet. I need one of those to be able to get that. Okay, I'm going to do it. I'm going to buy the blue sails. Um, so I'm going to pay um, one to send that one back. Yep, yeah, for more wood. And then I'll immediately spend it and, and also some um, the cotton thread. thread. Or whatever it is. That's useful that you've got that. It is not printed on here. Yeah. No. What? That. Whatever that is, it's not printed on here. Is it not? It's, 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 it's probably wool. Yeah, yeah, because there's a sheep. Yeah. yeah, so it's wool. Yeah. I want your bread sales, not blue sales. Wait on that. Oh, I wanted red cells, not blue cells. But... Right, okay. Do you want to change your mind? No. Well, you've already, yeah, but you'd already covered that one, though. There is no red, a red cells. Nope. I don't think so. Um, I'm going to play this card here, which I will need to use. I think. Is the, are these both blue this time? Uh, tin Cot food is blue, cotton fabric is red. Cotton fabric is red. Okay, so yeah. that cost me four trade tokens then. Yeah. So I'll spend these four. That one goes there. That's pretty good. There. Go the Who side. are you buying the canned food off? That's me. Who's got it? Yeah. Who yeah. are you buying the sales off? Who's got Not no. sales, cotton fabric. Who's got cotton? <coughs> uh, me and Gemma, I think. I'll go for Gemma. Yeah. Which is. <laughs> and then I get two more of these. Two more of those. So that's been quite a good four moves for me mm -hmm. because I've earned. Uh, 16 points from the cards, and I picked up All four of, those. of these as well. Yep, nice. Tidy. Right. And got rid of four cards. So I'm going to spend my four exploration tokens to play that card. Whoa. Which I'm going to use immediately to take two gold and four trade tokens. Okay, done. Now I can play that one. So now I can trade for the beer. See, this guy likes his coffee, but he also wants chocolate. <laughs> He's quite fussy. Schnapps, chocolate, and coffee in that order. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I've not got any of those expedition cards yet. I need to get some. Definitely don't. Okay. I'm borrowing uh, Nick's windows. Can't you make your own windows? Not now. Yeah, <laughs> but no. Maybe later. Okay. And using one of those to Did you get gold? I took a gold. That one into this. that one. Okay. That's it. There is a red cube in the supply. Quick, <laughs> get it. <coughs> um, I'm going to build um, a ship. This one. Four. How many Fox. red cubes have you got? <coughs> so, five, six. And paying a pound. You've got six as well. It. What are you counting? The number of red cubes in the game. Six. Yeah. Twelve. Eighteen. Twenty-four. Twenty-five. Yeah. <clears throat> it's right. There is twenty-five cubes in the game. I just had a horrible thought that I had like five cubes missing or something because they were <laughs> under the table or whatever. But no, there's twenty-five. What colour are the dresses? They're red, aren't they? Or the fur, the fur coat? Sorry. Red. Red. Uh, here. You'll go, I think. Yeah. Cards in hand, everybody. Uh, I've got thirteen. It's not. It's not going down. Eleven, nine, ten. Okay. It just feels like it keeps going up. <laughs> yeah, being in a position where I can't play. So, although that's that's starting to disappear now that more resources are entering the game. Um, what's good to buy that costs an engineer? What's Oof. 
that light bulb costs to really invest cool. in. Yeah. I mean, a fur coat. If you think more people are going to be using fur coats. That doesn't cost... I haven't got, I haven't got any trade tokens to buy all the other stuff with that, though. That's the only thing. Pocket watch or a pair of glasses if you need them. Mm-hmm. Anything else? Um, well, to buy any more ships. Oh, the champagne. Uh huh. Okay, I'm gonna buy there you some go, champagne. champagne. Perfect. So, what will that cost me? That will cost me mm, box, box, the glass, which glass. is blue, isn't it? And an engineer. And an engineer. There you go. Champagne is now in the game. Fantastic. Right, I'm playing woman with pipe. You don't often see women smoking pipes, do you? You don't. <laughs> so I need some beer. So Gemma, mm -hmm. you produce beer. Thank you. So there's one trade token. Um, a light bulb, which is there. And a sewing machine, which is there to play this card, which I will use immediately to have an extra action. And that extra action will be Hmm. Oh, I could totally do that. It's probably worth it. Light bulb. Champagne. What colour is it? Red. Two trade tokens. You get a gold. And coal. Uh, yeah, don't make the same mistake again, Paul. There you go. So this is the card that when I choose to use it, I get one of those okay. resources when I need it. Yeah, so I'll just, I'll just keep it there. I might use it, I might not. Now that the coffee's entered the game. Although the chocolate has not. Okay, you go, Emily. Festivaling. Chocolate is there. Mm. Gemma, you go. Um. <clears throat> How do I build a gramophone? Right. Mm. Definitely need some of these. Mm. Well, we need some of those investors to get. Some well, fur coats stuff. are available. Get your fur coats here. <laughs> I'm going to build some chocolate. Hey! You need pigs mm -hmm. and cocoa. So one pig. Um, is somebody else? Oh, there. Yeah. That's not good. Yeah. There you go. Right, chocolate's in the game now. Cool. Uh, I'm gonna put all my cute back. Your festivaling as well. Yeah. Right. So Actually, no. What did I just put back? Sorry, I'm such a fool. I want to build one of those actually. Chocolate red is. What did I put back? Can we rewind it? I'm so sorry. Here yeah, go on. What oh, I... you want me to look back at the video? Could you? I'm sorry. That's all right. It was a uh, blue. Yeah, it was that a blue somewhere. Blue. That's the advantage of streaming it. Is yeah. We can rewind the live video. Now. It looks like it's Can you shimmy it forward on the keyboard? Yeah. You can. What did I put back? Well, you can, we can pause it there. That's the chocolate. Oh, yeah, we can pause it there. So you had... A blue on glass. Oh, there you go. There and there. You see that? That is. So you put a green back. A, yeah. A red, red off of... And another You got a red on the boxes. And a red on the sails. You got a red on the sails. No, that was already there. Okay, yeah. I'm sorry. We're good. <laughs> there you go. We are good. Okay. Um, I want to build one of these for two trade tokens. So it will cost me uh, a red sail, uh, a red box, and a green wood. And I get two trade tokens immediately, don't I? Mm hmm Yeah. Sorry about that. So I can't play that. Um, can't play that. Can't play that. Can't play that. Oh, 
don't have soap. Oh yeah, but he needs that. Can't play that. Can't play that. Uh, can't play that. Does somebody mm. don't really want to play that? Because we've got this guy. Mm. Just remembered. Mm. Oh yeah. What's it the museum gets you? What, sorry, one point? Extra artifact is, oh, every artifact is worth an extra point. <clears throat> right, I'm going to play this. So I need some beer. Yep. I've got beer. You've got beer as well. I've bought a lot of Gemma stuff. I have a lot less money than Nick, though. I don't mind, yeah. I don't mind yeah. if Gemma wants the money. Okay, go on then. I'll, buy, I'll, I'll trade for one of your beers with that. So that's that card gone. Uh, and I'll make some of my own bread to play this card, which, what colour is coffee? Red. And chocolate's red as well? Yeah. So I'd need four trade tokens for both. Uh, yeah, I'm going to use it. I'm going to flip it over, take three trade tokens. Done. Yeah, it's these trade tokens. I'm constantly short. Mm, I didn't. When I built the extra level two, I thought mm. five trade tokens was too many. Mm. It's not been. No, it's no. been no. I need them every turn. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. Play I this. remember when I'd first played it, mm. the German version. I spoke to Martin Wallace. Mm. Because I was just curious as to how much he'd played the computer game, okay. and he'd played it enough. Okay. And he said trading is really important in the computer game, and he wanted to emphasise that yeah. in the board game. Okay. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna build this one. So. Cotton fabric. Cotton fabric. Beer. Beer. Oh, I have to buy my beer back for two. Or yep. well, you can use a trade token to somebody else's if you want to. Because I need the trade token. Ah, okay. uh, yeah, and the trade token to get two of these cards. Thank you. Willem has uh, popped into the chat. Good evening, Willem. Thank you very much for joining in. And for those people who've joined us in the last hour or so use the hashtag to say what team you're on either team Nick <laughs> team Paul team Emily or team Gemma uh, let us know in the chat whose team you're on so I'm going to buy this one here I'm going to buy another two things so I need to take I need to pay one two three four money four money to send them back to work so yeah and what's this other one it's the sales and the sales as well uh, seven money seven money wow one two three four five Six, seven, right. all that. To send all of them back again. Yeah, I know. Was it that one? That, that yeah. yeah. Okay, so then that was one. What was that? One of those, one of those, and one of those, which gets me that one. Oh, hello. And another two. Okay, I'm playing this. I need some cotton fabric, which is mine. I need a trade token, which is there. And I need some soap. I have soap. Go on, let's buy some of your soap. Blue? Yeah, blue. Should those two not have gone back to the general supply? Which two? These yep, two. You're, you're right. Uh, <laughs> to play that to get two of these cards. Yay, I got my first two cards. Nice. Okay. <coughs> now I just need the colored workers. Um, spend all of these. And then I need. If I can end the game now, I would. <laughs> yep, fur coat. Or it's red. Coat. Yeah. So two That's trade tokens for red. And a sausage. Sausages. I have a sausage. Gemma, yeah. And I get two of those cards as well. Okay. Thank you. <sighs> yeah. 
Yeah, it's a good team to be on, James. Who's got bread? bread. Uh, yes. yes. Bread, 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 okay. And also on team running out of space. Yeah. If I was starting this game again, ships are really important, aren't they? Mm. I'm guessing Emily's go. No, no, no. no? I've, I've got a card. I got some of those. All oh, yeah. oh, right, Gemma's yeah, go. Just thinking oh, about sorry. I'm sorry. I'm going to take all my. First of all, oh, no. <laughs> okay. sorry. Um, I would like to buy some cigars, please. So that will cost me wood and you trade for the tobacco. Go. So one to again keep paying to take wood. Yeah. And then one trade token yeah. for this one here. There you go. Perfect. Cigar factories in play. Right. Okay. Artisan to make some cotton fabric, worker to make some bread, trade token for some reason to play this one. So that goes. I'm going to use this one. Yeah, I see where you're going. To get rid of these two cards, which go to the bottom of the deck. And how many cards do you have left? I have in hand one, two, uh, no, one, two, three, four, five, six cards in hand. Ten. Okay. Okay, I'm upgrading stuff. Okay, so, <clears throat> so three upgrades. One. Oh, no. Yes, yeah, that's right. Yeah. It's going all the way up. All oh, right, so a coal hopefully. and the goods. What's your so upgrade card? Can a you coal go all the way with one card, can you? And hmm? a goods. Oh my god, there's only two. Makes that one into that one. You can upgrade a three things. Beam. Each thing can either be blue or red. And some no, it upgrades windows. Right. Makes that yeah, yeah. one into that one. And then exhausting one of those. And I need fur coat. Fur coat from here. Fur coat to move that one. Into one of those. Into one of those. Which if you wanted to, you could exhaust for five gold. Um, no. Okay. It has another purpose. Yeah. Can I see that card? Sorry. The one you used. Oh, no, sorry, you're upgrading. Oh, sorry, I'm yeah. just mad. Sorry, ignore me. Right. Gemma. Um. Uh, Willem's on your team. Brilliant. Because <laughs> Nick, Nick's his middle name. It's, it's a good name to have. It's a nice, strong name. <laughs> Buy some glasses for. And can I borrow some of your glass? One trade token. And. My stuff there. Brass. I'm one of those. Yep, there you go. Glasses are now in the game. Mm. There's not much that isn't now. Okay. Um, I want to play this card here, and I'll need to use somebody's bread. Yep. I have bread. Um, Emily also has bread. Emily, I'll use yours. Um, and then I'll use my own cigars um and my own one my own champagne uh, thank you for this card here for eight points you see on camera all stolen yeah. all the money i have <laughs> um and then i want to upgrade so you can upgrade three things three. once yeah and each thing can either be blue or red yeah okay but that can, i can turn a red into the this you one you can here, turn so. yes you could turn three red into three purple or three blue into three red or yeah. any combination of those th three things okay and i've got two Perfect moment. So I will turn one blue into a red and then two reds into these ones here. Or will I? No. I'm going to turn two blues to two reds and one red to a purple. So if I give you that one for the purple. Yep. And then I need two reds for those two. So I give you those two, and can you give me two reds, please? Thank you. And they were used, and that one goes on to that that blue one. Yeah, yeah. 
Uh, no, you can't move a blue into a red. Oh, so where should, <laughs> so where should it be? Those two were already used. So that one, so the blue would go to there and that one would be used like that. Yes, okay. that's it. Right. My go. I've got no tokens left. I could festival. I want a festival. Done. That's probably the last festival that I'm going to do, I think. Oh, I was cheating. Well, no, I wasn't. I was discarding those to the wrong place. Mm. But as long as you refill your ships, yeah, any excess that you've accidentally you taken... You know if you've got too many. Yeah. I think the rules might be you're actually supposed to spend them and then put them back yeah. when you replenish. Oh, I right. just put them there because it's it's easier to then yeah, okay. put them back on. One of those and then some ease. Gets me a bicycle. You made a penny farthing, have you? Yeah. I need that as well. Oh, it changes everything. Mm. <laughs> and it's purple? Yes. It's purple, isn't it? I'm going to build this one. So, some glasses, some coffee, and could I use um, some of these fur coats, please? That'd be mine. And is that two? It's two. It is red. So then I get another go. And I'm going to um, explore the... Old world again. Three speed. tokens. Emily's going to have to move a play raid. Oh, we haven't got quite. Two greens, please. There we go. Two greens. Thank you. Two cards. <laughs> Probably taking the card you gave back a minute ago. <laughs> uh, yes, it is. Uh, I'm going to festival. Your festival link. Right, so. Do I want to do this? I don't think I do. No, right. I'm going to upgrade. I am going to put that on there for a fur coat and exhaust that to turn that into that. That's one upgrade. Second upgrade is going to be to generate some steel to trade for some windows from. Windows. Uh, I've got windows. Oh, it's about the same. Go on, Nick. I can take some of your windows. Thank you. So that's two trade tokens. Yep. To move that into a purple. And then I will also spend that for another third coat and that for another one to turn that purple into another investor mm. because mm. of that it gets you 10 coins or 10 points 10 points at the end of the game okay i will then as a free action mm -hmm. exhaust an investor to get five gold okay so I did me upgrades i did me free thing and that is my go done I need more trade tokens. Yeah. Need more. Okay. Right. Um, I'm going to buy um, a ship. The only level two ship left. So a sail, a box. And some wood. Yep, comes with two trade tokens. And I can do nothing on can not I? Uh, so that <laughs> was your level two so shipyard. Do, you could so build a level one ship as well. One, um, over there. No, I don't think I'm going to. Okay, you're done. Um, I want to do a couple of upgrades. Um, I want to put one red to the purple and then two purples to two investors. Okay. I think. Are you, are you able to generate your own fur coats? No, I'll have to use yours, please. Can't I'll... use two of them. Oh. 
How much per fur coats cost? Uh, you need a sewing machine, uh, cotton fabric, and goods. I'm just wasting turns <coughs> in that way. I'll go for one. Okay. So what? So I'll go for. I'm just going to go from one to there and then one to there, uh -huh. a separate one. So what would that cost me? That would cost me a window, which is red. Yeah, window. Down there. Steel. And a steel, which is a red as well. Okay, so that has turned a red into a purple. Yeah, thank you. Okay. And then... Oops. And then you spend... Uh, I exhaust two, the red. Yeah, and spend two trade tokens. No? Yeah. Yes. Yes, two trade tokens for my fur coat. Yeah. Which then turns the purple, purple you just gave me into, into a, a turquoise. Okay, thank you very much. It's a shame. I've got, uh, nobody else, no, nobody else has got anything. Nobody else has got a focus. Do I want to upgrade anything else? Um, you got one other upgrade to do if you wanted to. I'm going to take another red because they're looking more useful. So I'm going to do a box and a coal. Uh huh. So what was that? So that's one red. And I've got a blue coal. I You've got blue coal. Thought, yeah. Yeah. To do that. Yeah. To turn that, that blue. one into a red, please. Into a red. Thank you very much. There you go. I right. think that was a good move. It's got me four points at least. Three upgrades. Mm -hmm. So, can't play that. Penny farthing. Did you say was it's purple? I got one. Yeah. That's three trade tokens. Schnapps is one, and I need an extra one, so I need five trade tokens for that. Can't play that. Can't play that. Tobacco. We have tobacco. It's red. That's two. Champagne. Yep. Red. Mm -hmm. Glasses. Yeah, can't play that one. <laughs> That's not even in the game. That's not even in the game. That's not in the game. Are you can start chucking some of your cards then with the editor. I think so. Do. I mean, I can't. I, I've just looked. I can't play any of them. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so. Yeah. Yeah. The first thing I'm going to do on my turn is I'm going to spend two exploration tokens to draw three of these. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. Okay, right. Now I need to start thinking about end game points. Oh boy. The cigar case. Yes. That unit, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah it is red. Cigar case and the barrels. Rum. I think that's Gemma. Is that you, Gemma? Oh yes. Um, yeah, it's I will red. use that one. Yeah. And of course, I've got to use my penny farthing to get rid of two cards. Hello. How many cards? Um, oh, currently still got loads. Two. Right. Seven. I get to get rid of two. I'm going to build this one. Four. One of my barrels. Do I put them back and underneath? Uh, bottom, yeah. yeah. Fur um, coat. Fur coat. Fur coat is me. And two trade tokens on two of your money. Oh, yeah. Yes. And um, one of your um, overalls. Things. Thank you. And I'm going to do that. You're going to flip it over? Whoa. Six trade tokens. Nice. Yeah. Do with that right now. Okay. Um, I am going to buy this tractor. Would you? Oh no! Oh no! I can't buy it because there's no. It's a steam carriage. Because nobody's got the previous one. No, oh, steam no. power hasn't been invented, so we oh, can't actually game. have a steam carriage. <laughs> oh, I've got three cards with that thing on as well, and none with the other. So somebody would need to buy that first one in order to get. This. Yeah. Oh, that's so annoying. Mm. Uh, what about the gramophone? What do we need for that? We need rubber, investor in wood, don't we? Uh, yeah. For the gramophone? Yeah. Brass, wood, and an investor. Okay. Um, I'll go for that one. So who's got brass? Yeah. Gemma, is it, what colour is it? Red. Okay, so that's two of those. Two of those. Some wood. And I take my, I exhaust my investor. Yeah. And that one goes on to here. Okay. What was that you just bought, sorry? A gramophone. A gramophone. So gramophones in the game, champagnes in the game, and coffees in the game. So how many how many trade tokens is that going to cost me? <laughs> Loads. Yeah. Six. The gramophone is that red? No. It's no, it's purple. purple. Oh. God. So it's going to cost me seven. Oh my god. Seven <laughs> trade tokens because I don't produce any of those things. That's too expensive. Yeah, me trying to run myself empty on cards when I can't play any of them, and I only have three trade tokens. I think I'm going to have to get into something. 
myself. What can I get into? Um, yeah, okay. It's my go, isn't it? Mm -hmm. So we're gonna go into coffee. So I'll spend one trade token to get some coffee beans. And we'll spawn we'll spend Arg. I'll spend a trade token for somebody's blue coal. Um I have blue coal. I think you've all got blue coal, haven't you? Go on, Nick. I'll take yours this time. Yes, thank you very much. With blue coal to make coffee. Pop it there. She's red. She's rubbish. <laughs> it is, isn't it? <laughs> right. Using yeah, that was a whole turn. Red cube and using your fur coats, Paul. Hey, more money. To upgrade to get another star. That's it. I'm gonna build this one. So I'm gonna um, buy all three of these from whoever has them, which is all seven of my tokens because it's a light bulb is me. Three. Which I've is got, three. I got coffee, two, and then the sewing machine from Nick. Yeah, just to spread it out. So they will go out. And it's eight points and an extra action. So for my extra action, I'm going to build this one, which is um, a red coal and a blue. So, so I can upgrade three. You can upgrade three things once, and each thing that you upgrade can either be green or blue. So I want one blue to a red. And please. it's free. Yeah. So one blue to a red. And two greens to two blues. Yeah. One, two. So if you keep one of the blues, maybe another blue. Oh, there we go. Thank you. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go for this card here. So I will use um, my own gramophone, and then I need to use somebody else's light bulb. That's you, Paul, isn't it? Is that's it? me. Oh, no, that cost me three. Three trade tokens and what's for a light bulb. What's the barrel bulb? cost? I believe the barrel is two. The blue. Um, the barrel is red, so it's two. Tokens. So that would cost me five tokens, wouldn't it? Yeah. No, oh, actually, I can't. Not going enough. No, sorry. I want that extra go. Yeah, purple. Buildings are expensive to trade for. Mm -hmm. Well, I'll put that one. Because that's not an action. I was thinking it was an action. It's not an action. It's a free action. It's a free thing. It? So you could have been doing that every turn if you wanted to. Yeah. Um, I don't know if he's got those two. That's um, Yes. Okay, I'm going to spend these two here for three tokens, uh -huh. which I will take straight away. So I'll turn them. Can you flip card. it over and take the tokens? Okay. I am going to spend two exploration tokens as a free action to get rid of that card. So he's never going to play it. Uh, and then as my actual action, How many cards have people got left? I've got five. I've got eight or something. Five. I've got six. Okay. I'm generating coffee, but I'm not generating anything else. Can't do that. Can't do that. that also, as a free action, I'm going to get five gold. And then I'm going to festival. I said it was going to be the last festival that I did. You I did, lied. didn't you? I was going to say. I'm festivaling. Okay. It's a quick turn. Gemma, you're not going to do it as well, are you? Mm. No, I don't think so. <laughs> That's the last festival I'm going to do. <laughs> Maybe. I need, I need to Maybe. Trade tokens back. It's the trade tokens, not necessarily the people. Um, that right now, yeah. Um, I'm going to do this one now then. So it cost me three for your light bulb. Light bulb. I used that one for my gramophone and two Gemma for your one. So that goes there. I get this card for eight points. I'm gonna take a free action. I'm gonna spend two of these adventure tokens and take three, three of, those of these snazzy cards, which I realise I 
put all into the wrong pile here, but I take three. Okay. One, two, three. Margo. How should you take three of this? Huh? Using that action. Mm. Oh, okay. Right. Coffee. Coffee. Check. Champagne? <laughs> yep. Red? Two trade tokens. You're using mine here. You can have a gold. Gramophone? Mm. Purple. Three trade tokens. And again. Have another gold. Uh, one, two. To play this card. Use it to discard two cards. Uh ooh. It doesn't actually matter. It doesn't actually matter. Those two cards are being discarded. And then as a free action, I'll spend these two. Now then. <laughs> They're your last two cards. They're my last two cards. You could end the game. No, because you're going to do each of these once. Oh. So it's going to be that one. I have one card left in hand. Oh, I see. Okay, yeah. And you've got enough. So you've got enough to get rid of it. I have enough to get rid of it. And the rules are we finish finish that round round and do one one more round. round. Okay. Start player with Gemma. So you will get at least two more turns. What colour is chocolate? Red, isn't it? My coffee. If only I was making my own A, um, fur coat, please. Paul. That's me. And a sausage, please. Is it Gemma that does it? I have a blue sausage. Oh, a blue one, yes, perfect. Tasty blue sausages. Yeah. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Nice. Been a very different game to the last one, which is interesting. In a good, in a good uh, way. Yeah, in a good way. Different routes have been gone down on here, and yeah. different things have happened. So I see that there's not going to be a huge amount number of. Turns. I could potentially end the game on my turn, mm. which means you would have this turn and then one more. So I don't know whether to swap some cards or whether to festival. I think I'm going to try swapping some cards. Okay. I'll go for one of those and hmm. no, two of those and one of these. Need more trade tokens. What you're swapping? But two of those and one of that one, please. Two of those. And one of those. Thanks. Which I'm pretty sure is the one I threw away. I mean, if you play it for three points, but it was no good to me because it got me extra cards. Oh, Paul, are you going to end the game or are you not? If I don't, mm. I mean, the main way of getting points in this game is by playing cards. Yeah. I have one card left. I'm either going to play it or I'm going to discard it. Mm. Then I get one go afterwards. Yeah. Okay. Well, unless I decide to, I should yeah, I, I I might not end the game because if I if I want to play this card and I can't afford to, I might festival, mm. which <laughs> there's only one guy, everybody else is at home. But it's the trade token. It's no. just yeah, I I I've got so many workers, so much money to send them home, but I'm not producing the right resources for mm. the cards that I've got. Yeah, maybe I should have swapped. Oh, but if I do that, then I miss out on that. Oh, that's right. So you could make sure that your workers are right for these cards. Which they're not. Ah. <coughs> and I can't upgrade reds into purple. Because I haven't got any windows. <clears throat> and I'm going to trade tokens to get the windows. Oh, yeah. I don't think Paul's going to win the game. I'm going to festival. And then I'm going to regret it in a minute. Very quickly. So I am going to win the game. Oh, no. <laughs> I am going to use those two as a free action to discard a card, even though it was a great card. Mm. Um, and as my actual action, I am going to go fur coat, 
exhaust, convert a purple into one of those. And I can't, can't really do that. I can do this. So I can generate um, two lots of boxes and two lots of coal to turn. Oh no, because there isn't any left. <laughs> so that's it. Done. Okay. So yeah, so we finish this. Oh, so I get this. And then we finish this round and then we play one more. Mm. And in that last round, I do nothing. So I, don't only, know. I only have one more go. You have one more go, yeah. I don't know why I'm helping you, but why don't you exhaust one of your things for five things? That's true, thank you. Remember that. <laughs> I, w I was thinking of doing that and then forgot. <laughs> this is a silly amount of gold. Bread, I have. Bread. Does that get you anything at the end? Yeah, every three gold is a point. Okay. That's and like then 25 gold. The gramophone. With Nick's gramophones. Yeah, three. three tokens. One, two, three. And um, chocolate, please. Uh, yep, it's got the chocolate. The red one, yeah. And I get an extra turn. I guess I don't really need it. Didn't use that. Mm. Interesting. You used that card, did you? I didn't. Yeah. Another Did you put that on your score? You still get the points for it, even even if you don't. You get the points for playing it, oh, I whether you've used it or oh, not. I thought you meant you didn't actually use the cards. I'm sorry. Yeah, the ability of it, I didn't didn't use in the end. Using your fur coat. Oh, could have a money. Yeah. Cool. That's it. Right, last round then. <laughs> oh. So you get one more turn? I will get one more turn. Because Gemma started. Yeah. Because oh, right, you finish okay. the round and do one more round. Oh, okay. I th oh, okay. I see. There's actually nothing I can do that's going to get me anything. <laughs> There's no point. I'm swapping my cards because nope. I don't have another go. No. Nope. Um, I can't upgrade any blues to reds because there are no There reds. are no reds. Um, I don't have any um, Z tokens left. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Just literally think that's okay. worth doing. I have a festival. <laughs> Is that even It doesn't do doing? anything. <laughs> but. Yeah. Right. What are you um, going to do in your last turn? Do I? I'm toying between two of these. For, for, for the last cards? Well, there's only two anyway. Yeah. I'll take this one for eight points. So I will use my own champagne. I'll need to use somebody's chocolate. Chocolate over there, which is red, I think. Yeah. It's red, yeah. Okay, so two of those take a coin. And then I'll need to use somebody's sausage. I have a sausage which is a blue. Okay, take a coin then, John. And I don't, there's no point in using it. So. Actually, oh no. Maybe there is. What, for these cards here? Yeah. I'm thinking. How many purples do you need? Uh, one, two, three. I've got three. You got three. And then the reds, I need. One, two, three, four, five, wow. six, seven. Okay. So, I, but I can't go to red because it's no, but because uh, there's no yeah. yeah. Oh, anyway. Okay, so I won't use them. Okay, done. Uh, my turn. I will exhaust that. Can I have a five gold piece, please? Yeah. Oh, actually, I'm gonna do the same. Yeah, I think that's it. I don't think I'm actually gonna do. No, I'm not well, I'll have a festival. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> I'm going to do coal and boxes. Oh no, I can't make it into red. Can those school pads first game? I don't think so. Um, okay. Yeah. Oh no, I do have Oh, the luggage has just red. popped in. Just in time for final scoring. <laughs> I do have an extra red. So, I will do a window and a steel beam to make my red into purple. Now, and then um, red and the fur coat. 
Can I have another coin, please? <laughs> Make that one into a light blue. That's why I went for the fourth. Right, okay. So, game is over. First thing we need to do is add up the points from all cards that you played. Sixty-four for Emily. Sixty-one. Sixty-one for Nick. Sixty-one for me. Sixty-one for Gemma. Right. Okay. Next. I don't want to check. <laughs> um, these cards. So basically, play out all of your cards, and then put cubes on them, remembering that every artifact is worth an extra point. And then add up the points. Which is our tip out. One's on the right hand side. And you only put one on each. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep. Yeah. I got 19. 13. 13. I thought you got loads of them. I had a lot of lower ones. You got a lot of reds. Lot yeah. Of I mean, that worked well because of that. Yeah. I think mine's ten, but could you just double check? So that's two, that's, that's three, four. I can't see. That one's three. Because <laughs> um, it's... It's three. Anything on the right is plus one. Oh, plus one. Yeah, yeah double. plus one. Okay, okay. Yeah. One, two, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine. Yeah, I've got six, was it 16? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eleven, thirteen, fourteen... Um, 16. 16. All oh, right, okay. Um, money? Yeah, silly. It's every three, did you say? Yeah. I got 12. Four points for me, please. Four points for Nick. Three points for me. Three for Gemma. Two. Three for Emily. And I got seven for the mm -hmm. fireworks. So, Gemma, 73. Uh, Nick, uh, what's that? 77, 81. Uh, me, 83, 102, 114. Uh, Emily, 79. Okay. So 114, Nick with 81, Emily with 79, Jeremy with 73. Right. Definitely having played it twice helps. I had an idea of where the points come from. And oh no, hang on, we haven't finished. World's Fair. Oh yeah. Ten for no, Emily. No. <laughs> ten for me. Any turquoise cubes? I think one. You got one, so it's an extra four. Mm -hmm. So it's eighty-five. One, two, four. And those ones as well. Oh yeah, yeah. Forgot them. <laughs> Eighty-nine. I got both of those, so that's an extra twelve. So that's one hundred and thirty-six. Sorry, people. You got, I got one of one them. Of them. Six. You got six, putting you on 91. So that's just Pips Emily. You didn't get any? No. Right. So you took, you took second place with 91. Mm -hmm. Emily with 89. Mm -hmm. Thoughts? Oh, it's crunchy, isn't it? What a brain burner this one is. It is, mm -hmm. but it's not heavy in terms of the rules. No. A but lot of the games that we've played together mm. are far more complex in terms of the rules themselves mm. this one is heavy in a in a, in a different way in that yeah. you've got to work yeah. out the patterns and everything else yeah I mean how long has we been playing for it says 2 hours 54 so what, it, it, it's a 2 and a half hour game minutes, yeah once you've played it once mm. it's a 2 and a half hour game which for the amount of mental energy for a 2 and a half hour game I always felt engaged mm. apart yeah. from the time where I was looking at my hand of seven cards, none of which I could play because they all required mm. things that weren't in the game. Yeah. And I was like, mm, what do I do? Mm. And then I, at that point, that's when I just 
because I got the fur coats by then, I just had a couple of rounds while I just upgraded things. Mm. Yeah. Um, I think like with all games, you spend the first one sort of looking and trying to work out what doing what does and what how it gets you and stuff like that. So like you say, playing it before yeah. really helped. But I think I, I think it's a really good game. I enjoyed playing it. It was good fun. I like the way you do stuff. I think it works well at four. Three will probably be good. Two, I'm, I'm not so sure. I'm playing it great. again at two on Monday okay. and I will let you know okay. because the last time I played it at two mm. was eight months ago. Mm. Something didn't quite work right and I can't remember what it was. Yeah. And I'll find out again on Monday. And, and yeah, anybody who's watching this live or watching this afterwards, if you've played it at two, if Willem's still watching. Mm. Are there different um, rules? Like are nope, there less nope, pieces? No, nope, literally no change whatsoever. But you'd end up using a lot more of these, wouldn't you? Would you? You'd need to. You'd need to build so much more. Yeah. You? You'd need to have loads of stuff because you wouldn't have so many people. You to wouldn't be able to borrow it. I see what you mean, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But the big thought for me, I think, is that you spend a hell of a lot of time building up this engine that doesn't really earn you many points for all that time. Like, in terms of look at all the cards we did, actually playing these cards was probably about, what, a fifth, a sixth of all of our actual turns. The rest of it was working up towards it. Yeah. Like, but... I know I couldn't have been, I wasn't as efficient as I could have been. But, but to felt... play the cards, mm. you need the stuff. Yeah. That's what I was saying at the start. You will have to do all of this stuff. Yeah. But this doesn't get you points. No. You're doing this as a means to an end. Yeah. You're doing this to play the cards. Yeah, everything on the board <coughs> and the cube. Well, not the cube so much, but everything on the board is is wasted actions in terms of actually earning you points because you're <coughs> yes. using it to earn points. But, yeah. I don't know. What about you guys? Emily, you played it before. How did you, what did you think? What I thought was interesting about this time was how different I found it right. because right. of the cards I had that were different. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah. last time I managed to build a few things that did earn me a lot of money and that really helped. Mm. Whereas there I couldn't build anything that seemed new enough for people mm. to, to want to trade often. And I think that makes quite a difference. Mm. Okay, Jenna? I struggled with no money at the beginning because mm. um, mm. it meant that you well you couldn't keep I'm um, taking back your cubes so I had to do quite a lot of um, festivals but yeah <laughs> <laughs> the fur coats was important yeah yeah and the sewing machine I kind of fell into the, what persuaded me to go for the sewing machine was, was this mm. but I'm glad I did because then that led to the fur coats and the fur coats is suddenly what you need to get the investors mm. yeah. and then I was I mean I I mean you made a killing on the overalls early on yeah. but my was it the cannons that I got early? Yeah. I think the cannons and the fur coat the cannons for you as well were just well. used massive yeah. amounts because so, you I mean, need I, them for all the boats yeah I mean I ended up with how much money? 36 money 37 money at the end mm. it's just insane yeah, but my problem at the end was <clears throat> the lack of trade tokens. Mm. You know, I had so many people and so much money, but I couldn't do anything because everything I needed to do <clears throat> required six trade tokens. Mm. So I'm like, I do it, and then right, yeah. I need another festival just mm. to get me trade tokens back, which seems in that ca in that sense, I think I was quite lucky. I had quite a few cards that got me trade tokens. Right. So that helped. Yeah. Yeah, it's interesting. But anyway. Cool. Yeah. Thank you we are done. Yeah. We are done. Um, fur coats and cannons, maybe cheaper coal. Yeah, the cheaper yes. coal. The, the blue coal was good. I don't remember using any coal, though. I don't think. I don't think I used it. So, Willem's more. played it at two. He says there's far less trade when playing it at two. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, because with, with four, the resources are shared out between four players. Yeah. So, you are trading Together, with yeah. three other players. Mm. Whereas with two, you will have half of the stuff and the other player will have the other half of the stuff. Or you could put one of everything on the board or something like that. As a neutral. Yeah, oh, right. And like a little variant. Actually, you could take each of the different colour ones and take one off 50% of them randomly. I to, don't know. to force the trade. Yeah, between, well, to yeah. Force, force a bit more interaction. Maybe. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I think, I think you're right. I think four might be the optimum number. Mm. And I think three would be okay, but I think two would lose something. Yeah. But I say, I'll find out again on Monday when, when Dan comes over. Cool. So we are all done. Uh, thank you very much to everybody for watching live. Um, and thank you to everybody for watching this afterwards. As always, please give me a like. Subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed. Uh, and this video is a whole series of videos that's been created this week thanks to the support of the Patreon campaign. So if you like the content that I create, uh, please consider supporting me on Patreon as I do rely on that support to keep these videos going. Link is in the bottom right, patreon.com forward slash gaming rules. 
Uh, but that's everything. It's a good night from me. It's a good night from him, to yes, quote exactly. 70s British <laughs> comedy shows. Mm. Cheers, everyone. I'll see you soon. Proudly sponsored by Game Toppers, upgrading your gaming experience. Visit GameToppersLLC.com.